And we're off to a wonderful start. <laughs> Here we are. Welcome to, um, yeah, <laughs> good one. I just said it all. Your first I sentence just said of the it. day, and you can't even finish it. Yeah, well, you do how much Welcome sleep to I got last night. Welcome to day. It is uh, the top tier of ladies' cricket on the Sunshine Coast. <laughs> and the top tier of commentary. Commentary <laughs> from <laughs> one side of the commentary team. Hi, oh, Max. I'm Lano. Thanks for having me. Glad to be here. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, we'll see you later. Uh, this is uh, Pink Stups, semi-final number one. Uh, what can we tell you? Uh, the toss has been had. Uh, the visiting team, Karoy, won the toss and decided to bowl. Yeah, and Dean are quite happy with that decision. They're going to be batting, obviously. Because there is another option. And we're underway very quick today. Uh, pretty much everyone is on the field, except for the batsmen and the uh, co uh, spectators and us and the cameramen and the, you know. Okay, so just the players are yeah, on the field and the umpires. Exactly. So that makes a lot more sense. So we've, uh, we've got our uh, left-hand, right-hand opening partnership going out. We've got Linda Callender, who's a left-hander, of course, flying the flag for left-handers around the world. We love you. And we've got uh, our token parent. See Perrin. If you look on your screens, you'll see Perrin. There she is, um, wearing it number four. I was going to say, if you're uh, if you're wondering, it's actually number one and two batsmen, but they're wearing number three and four. Yes, exactly. It's going to confuse me to no end. I'm sure it will. Like no other. Uh, apparently, there might be people watching us from all around the place. Maybe some as far fa far flung as Nas from uh, far away. If you tell us who you're going for, who you think is going to do anything today? He's wrong yet. All right, so we are ready for play. And umpire just bowling from the random singular brick wall at uh, third man end. <laughs> it's a good start. Oh, you know what I realised? What have you realised? I forgot to... Uh Oh, it's probably best you did that. I think there was all kinds of potty mouth going on out there before you turned that up. Yeah, that's fair. Hmm. Yeah. Maybe scoring. Maybe I'll do that. Well, that's why I haven't put the scores up. You ready? You good? Shot that ticket that's away. Any day now. And the field is saying they're ready out there, so let's uh, put those scores hope up. this is a dot. Here we go. Oh, played around the corner. Oh. No run taken. Third ball, which I already had in there. Right, we as always. We're all using the same internet. No. Oh, no. What's going on? I'm receiving notifications that everything is wrong. We should boldly just go through it. Ignore everything. Bowler is uh, Alison Lindsay, also known as Rex. Um, no, no, can I get you? I only started playing three years ago. Oh. Mm -hmm. You need me to do some producing? That doesn't sound right. Ooh. Is that going to be called a wide? No, no wide. I'm ready. I'm ready for any any yeah, calling. No, no, you don't uh, don't need to do anything. Hmm. Oh, That's big shot! Whomped. That's been whomped and caught. Taken. Wicket, wicket, McSmicket, and I think if uh, our cameraman can get a close up on the echoing batsman, the I think we've got uh, the echoing batsman. Something to to do there. That's a little unlucky, but uh, Quackmire makes his first appearance of the day, I believe. That's unfortunate. And, uh, well, let's take a look at what happened there. Let's see what happened. Oh, 
Yeah, it's gone up. And safely taken. Snavelled. I see you've taken to using my lines now, which you poured scorn on in previous streams. Yeah, I'm just waiting for you to start uh, forgetting the end of your sentences. That won't happen. Is there more to that? Won't happen today. This is uh, Flynn coming out. Yes, Flynn. Off the back of two night shifts. Oh, we don't have number three and four out there now. We've, uh, we've got 69. Uh, and three. Uh, yep, 69. Oh, I thought the batsman may have crossed there. No, just the outgoing batsman was cross. That's fair enough. And not the start that Yandina would have liked today. That's what we love about you, Max. Insightful commentary. Oh, I do some wonderful things. You can't complain too I, much. Well, I do. I complain quite a lot, actually. Well, I know, but I don't. What? Did you say something? No, I just forget the end of that sentence. All right, Rex, ready to come in to finish you over. Ooh. And Dina getting caught up in the in the hype. That's a good over. That's a wicket maiden. What do we call that? A, uh, a hot dude. That's right. That's what we do call that now. <laughs> That's one for none off one over. And thank you to our viewers who have tuned in already. I, uh, at the moment, I can't see if we have any chat. Let's I'm seeing no chat. No chat is seen. Here, no chat. Ah, going to be some shots played in this over. We spoke to the wicket keeper earlier today. She'd drawn some pictures on her arm so she'd know if it was a right-handed or left-handed batter. Well, you can usually tell just by the aggressiveness. So, let's see how we go here. Oh, looking quite aggressive there. Dot just to working their way into it after an early wicket. It's uh, consolidating their innings. Consolidated, yeah. Into one manageable total. It sounds far too intelligent for you to be saying it. Where are you reading that from? Oh, it might have been an audition I did once at some yeah. stage or something. So today, unfortunately, we're without the aid of the weather chair. But we do have the Bureau of Coleology here who will be able to look up to the sky and tell us what's going to happen. It's another dot. Are you sure she's left-handed? Well, she's working her way into it. Into being left-handed. Well, into the innings. She's going to have a long one today. Right. Looking at retiring, maybe by the end of the innings. Hmm. How many runs? Let us know, people, if uh, the stream's... If you're not enjoying the stream, hit the like button. Mm. Let us know that you don't like uh, anything that we're doing. Yeah. Because the uh, the number of dislikes don't show up anymore. If you do like the stream, you can also uh, hit the like button. Hit that like button. Um, yeah. Um, if you're indifferent, there's also the subscribe button there. That's, uh, <laughs> That'll you know, make sure yeah. that you find out that you need to come and hit the like button to show your dislike. At a later date, yeah. yeah. Everything's there for you. There's also a bell if you if you need to ring us for any reason. Give us a bell. That way uh, you press that. <laughs> yeah, you're happy with yourself, aren't you? Yep. I love the way that uh, we've got two cameras on the game and we're both leaning around the monitors <laughs> to watch the bowler come in and bowl. What I was talking about, I'm actually looking through the uh, five centimetre gap between the monitors. <laughs> so am I. Oh, it looked no like it was going to be something. Taken. Turned out to be a clonk. Yeah. 
it's, uh, it's a new fact I haven't seen about Linda before mm -hmm. uh, at the non struggs end. Uh, she's also known as Steve Irwin. Oh. I don't know that she is or not. Maybe she once wrestled a snake. Good cricket shot. If we're not careful, cricket could break out here, people. Well, it's sounding like it may be a little bit windy about 80 metres above us. <laughs> <laughs> we should be getting a visit from the aliens sometime soon. There we go. Jackie Flynn gets Quagmire out of the question. As the first run for the game. Karoy bowling very well. No sundries as of yet. S. Undry. I thought it was extra. It could be. I think they're related in some fashion. Here comes Rex. Bowling around the wicket to a left-hander. Has that hit the stumps? Yes, it has. Bold. Polarized. Left-hander gone well before they were wanting that. Wicket, wicket, McGon. Radio. I believe. No. Oh, I think yes. I believe it is. Radio. And here comes Linda. There we go. And let's take a look at what happened there. Oh, straight through, just clipping the top of the stumps. Mm. Let's uh, let's go back. Look on the other camera. Oh, it is the other camera. There we go. Off stump. Well done. That's two for one off three. It look, looks as though it's just clipped the bale. Whoa. Bale's gone up. Unlucky. But good cricket from uh, Karoy Yumundi here. I'm getting confused because someone's trying to get me some information without actually spelling it out for me. <laughs> and of course, if someone spells it out for me, I can't read. So can't it's, it's read. just no luck. You can't, you can't word either. Hmm? <laughs> I don't know. N U M B E R S? Oh, I think there's a hashtag in there somewhere. <laughs> someone's asked me how I spell numbers. Yes. <laughs> I probably no. got it wrong. <laughs> so we've got more bowling from the other end. She had one over and she... You can fill the rest of that sentence, I'm sure. I was going to say, more bowling. Yes, that's what I said. That's what you said. So, uh, Lindsay's been uh, very expensive. Two for two. Two. Oh, some runs coming here. Well cut off. I knew it was two for two. I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, yeah, Lots he's doing the scoring. <laughs> don't look at me. <laughs> Donna Moore from Harvey Bay. It's a bit of a drive. Only grandma in the team. Represented Victorian AFL and cricket. Very sporty. Is this... Uh See our number seven batsman also left-handed. Seven. Also left-handed. Well, let's hope it's a different fate than our previous. This is Kay Scott, our ever dependable. She needs to be. She needs to soak up pressure like depends. If you're dependable. Dot. Court umpire says, no, there's two of us today. <laughs> we didn't check on the charging uh, state of the umpire shirt. Well, from what I could tell as they were walking out, they were both quite well charged. Um, one, maybe the battery's not as good. It looks like it actually have faded a little bit since they've the got out there. End. Yeah, it's not holding its charge. And 
the dot. And uh, Donna, the bowler, Donna Moore. It's almost like he said that already. Mm -hmm. I reckon it's going down late. They listen to our advice of um, making sure they say the name of the the bowler. The ball, loudly. yeah, so that we can uh, so pick we out who it is. This is likely the final ball of the over. Yes, I think so. Donna in, come around that we get for that one. Ooh. Oh, yeah, no, no, wait, no, yep, no. It's like Max running out there. Ends up being a dot, but not a wicket. End of the over. Chew for chew of four. Three of four. Yeah, I added that. That was two. I'm looking at the score up here on the screen. It looks right to me. It agrees with what I've got here. Because I put it. <laughs> Well, this is, uh, it's very interesting listening to a one-sided conversation here. Because <laughs> I hear. can only hear uh, someone who's got a microphone on. Maybe we should get our extra microphone over the scorer's desk and they can say, Guys, you got it wrong! <laughs> Allegedly, it's two for three, even though... Ah, uh, what would the scorers know? They're sitting at the scoring desk. Well, that was a maiden, and it was two for two in my cricket, and now suddenly it became two for three. I want an inquiry. Except for that one run they didn't take. That's a dot. We're working our way into it. We'll be doing a uh, Jackie Sparkles check at some point. She's getting some uh, shadow eye in. Thought she was going in at number four. Isn't she out there? Nope. Um, yes, she is. Oh, yeah. I knew that. I didn't see her sleepwalking through it. That's a dot. I mean, it's almost like you said that she got off Quackmire before. I did. It's good having you, Lana. Thanks for being here. Pleased to have me. Thank you for <laughs> being here. <laughs> Just don't have my things down, do you? Comes Rex. Well, no, not when you mix half of them together. I'm left with nothing. Look, my brain is a blender at the moment, so I've thrown in a few ingredients and uh, and potatoes. You came up with a pizza. Pizza? That no. sounds good. <laughs> pizza sounds great. No, stop saying that. <laughs> my camera is about to do nothing. <laughs> Right, here we go. Lindsay, Rex Lindsay. Ooh, good shot for Dot. Right, has anyone spotted the uh, the mystery run in this over from anywhere? Nope. Let's right. flirting with it out there. You are. Yeah. It's the end of the over. The score is what I say it is. <laughs> Two for three. And oh, Fred McKee says a great start by the Cougars. Absolutely. And and, and the young ones as well. <laughs> and like, I'm getting in trouble now. <laughs> seems like... Seems like... <laughs> No, I'm, I'm just making really bad jokes over here, hoping that nobody's actually tuning in. Well, it seems like Fred uh, Fred tunes in just to watch whoever is playing Yandina and to support them. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds right. <laughs> Glad to have you, Fred. <laughs> All right. Looks like, uh, is it? Uh, it doesn't look like more. Well, well, less is more. Might be Kayla New. Someone new. I wish someone did. Then we'd know who was bowling. Wishka! Left hand. That'll be a dot. Ah, oh, no, the scorers are telling you that was uh, was run there. <laughs> and telling me fibs. 
Ah, it's Underwood. Ah, uh, that's left-handed. Turn around the corner. And push through for a single. That's that's quite far out of the way for both batters. Yeah. Now, now they can now open the floodgates. Yeah, and, and maybe that's why the uh, the left-hander was, was waiting, waiting for that one that they could just uh, turn around off their legs for that bread and butter. And now they're going to put all the meat into the sandwich. Apparently. Finish it off with a glass of milk. Underwood bowling. Jackie with a womp. A little clonkish. If only she had a helmet cam. It's a good helmet she's it's wearing. It's a very though. nice helmet that she's wearing, actually. Scored some runs, I reckon. Oh, yeah. Ooh, it'd be a wide. No, no wides today. Except for magic wides. Fred McKee, haha, -ha, always happy, always happy to support the underdogs. Can Cougars be underdogs as their cats? <laughs> I'm leaving that well alone. Oh, a bit of fancy footwork in there. Short mid wicket area, stops any runs. Hill. Oh, full toss. That'll be a wide. That's uh, that's been given us wide. Good. I'm gonna put that in as uh, some two runs. Put it in as five. Catch up eventually. And uh, wood in. What a good shot. Cut away. That's nice. That's going to go Chasing all the way. it down. No, no, no. no. They've cut it off. I was watching a bird. They're coming back for a second, though. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh. I think if the ball got onto the stumps there, that might have been close. Two taken. Guys, I'll just let you know, guys, you're You're getting full immersion today, people. I, uh, I think I muted my microphone to tell those people under the microphone yeah, that they were under the microphone. I heard. <laughs> I heard you do that. <laughs> oh, no. It's very Inception-like. I'm in trouble now. What have you done? Two for seven. Off six overs. I'm just getting phone calls from people that I was meet in meetings with from two in the morning. So, uh, uh, just do some producing over there. Yeah. <laughs> Got lefty on strike. Oh, looks like they're uh, taking a lot of time getting everything right here to Boulder Scott. Change of bowler. We've got Agent Anderson. Miss Anderson. She gets a hat trick. Is it called a Trinity? It could be. <laughs> dad joke! Uh, <laughs> you can't give a dad joke for something that's off air. <laughs> oh, that was played very left handedly. I was, pl I was playing the dad joke because of my <laughs> bad joke. No one knows what it was about. Anyway, it was a neo classic joke. Anyway, <laughs> oh, no Morpheus of this. <laughs> oh, someone's going to cut the cord. <laughs> Whatever you're thinking, Max, don't say it. Oh, I, think, don't. I think we should just switch out of this. <laughs> Oh, some tank will come through oh, and destroy us. Oh, damn it. That's where I was going. <laughs> or maybe someone will hack into the system, some sort of cipher. Oh. Not like this, Max. <laughs> Not like this. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh, yes. Oh, yeah. 
Well, that really bugs Mouse. me. Really bugs me. I was trying to think of the name of the other, the well, other character. I think your last joke was a real dozer. <laughs> 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 what is it with you and movies? Me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, you're the one who... What made, did I made, do? You made the Anderson thing which started this all. <laughs> and put this on me. Let us know what movie we're talking about in the chat if you've <laughs> just arrived on our planet. All right. Anderson in. Maybe it's not... They're not on the planet. They're in this simulation with us. You have to let it go. <laughs> Getting a cold reception from you. <laughs> if I can find uh, I'm just feeling a bit aloof over here. I'm really struggling to find Ooh. a way to work Merrillingian into this conversation. <laughs> <laughs> we've See, we've got a button over. here for any friend. <laughs> <laughs> it's the end of the over. Well bowled. It's. Uh, <laughs> It's good that they're uh, far enough away from us out in the middle that they're not hearing all of the rubbish no. that we're talking about so they can focus on cricket. They can complain when they rewatch it later on. It's two guys, seven off seven. Guys, we were playing some good cricket out there and you idiots were talking about <laughs> movies. <laughs> what conversation do you think's going on? Uh, well, not there anymore. Uh, <laughs> got a uh, comment here that's just come through the chat. Have we? Yeah, I'll let you read that one out. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what's worse, that the scorer who's sitting two and a half metres away from us feels that they need to comment on our YouTube stream. Well, I think they just want to be on the record of saying they do not approve. <laughs> that was bad and you are bad. <laughs> oh, that's been given as a wide. So there was a left-hander on strike then. See them, uh, I always thought the wide signal was um, putting the arms out sort of as wide as you could go. But this umpire's got an interesting W signal that he's going. So guys, that's a that's a wicket. Maybe he's got no. It's a, uh, a wide w, w for W for wide. He might have some serious elbow issues. Maybe. Bad maybe elbows. He's, maybe he's played some touch football and. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Underwood oh. played. They're taking a quick single. Jackie Sparkles oh. little legs going 100 miles an hour there. Direct hit there. Well, uh, she was almost caught sleeping at the uh, striker's end. She was. Not to be confused with the sleeping she was doing not that long ago. But uh, I understand it's well earned. Well earned. All right. Things are about to ramp up with yeah. the left-hander on left strike. Left-hander on strike. They've already played the, be the bread and butter around the corner shots. Let's have a full toss on the hip. Oh. oh, more around the corner. There's more bread and butter here than an English morning tea. One run taken. We are here in our... Uh, Not-so-concrete bungalow. Yeah, it's our Boggo Road. It's this flimsy thing. Flimsy thing here, Boggo Road cell. I'm actually concerned leaning on it. It may fall down. It could. You wouldn't want to park your car behind it. <laughs> wouldn't be safe at all. <laughs> My keys are uh, well and safe away from that. Oh, I think that may have been an edge. Edgy bra. And looks like the cameraman lost that one after it went through the uh, slip cordon. He's gone on holidays. Ah, oh, that's fair enough. He's gone to explain our jokes to someone. Why? We should be using the cameras. The score is saying, get back, get back to your cameras. Let's do uh, ball follow with that. Ooh. Oh, I had a nice big think about that. He did, decided not to. The umpire said, look, if you're going to do that, you're not going to have enough runs to uh, finish that sentence with. Yeah. Well, it's going to throw someone under the bus, but... Best not to. No. Not this early. Mark my words, there'll be more time. Underwood in. Oh, Ooh, I think she got bad on that. Oh, oh, maybe OT's. overthrows. Look at him! Look at him go! Two runs. She's taken seventy-five little strides to get uh, to the other end there. Two well-earned runs. I'm not a fan of the overthrows when I'm batting because you're like, oh, 
all that effort into the run and you're like just at the point where you're like, oh, it's good, it's over. And then someone else is going, hey, run Go some again. more. I don't mind what? if I hit it. Well. Well, White. Yeah, it's been given the big there's, dubs. There's the W. The McDowell's W. Still waiting on our first boundary of the day, but uh, from the looks of it, both batsmen are uh, really trying for it. Well, it's a shame that uh, Kez Matthews retired last season and hasn't played in the last two games we've streamed already with Yandino playing. I'll get that. Well, the, un the only Wait. boundaries that are being crossed here is by <laughs> you and me. <laughs> two for 13, off eight overs. Uh, I get the feeling in the middle they're saying, uh, I reckon those commentators are saying stupid stuff about us. Do you reckon they're driving buses? I reckon they're driving I reckon buses. They're yeah, yeah. yeah I'll go down here out of shot and um, hopefully the cameraman doesn't That was a it. very interesting uh, bit, of, bit of work from the camera. It's like, yeah. if I just pan this ever so slightly... They'll both disappear. They'll both disappear and we'll have a different focus of the shot. It's very mm. artful. I don't think any of that was deliberate. I think it was all deliberate. Well, if by deliberate you mean accidental, then yes, yeah, so I agree. Look, it, it <laughs> you've got nothing. I've got <laughs> something, but I might have to queue up an advertisement. All right. We've got Anderson. Andersons. I reckon that's going down late. Ooh, yeah. Still a dot, though. When it hits your pad and goes through to the keeper, it's either out, caught behind, or it's uh, a dot. <laughs> What's going on? Good morning to Jeff Dot if you're watching. Uh oh. Uh oh, what? It's a dot. Oh. We haven't even been giving him any jip this morning. I know. On air. <laughs> well. I think it might be fake. We've got a fake Pete McCauley in the chat. I think there's we've no we There's no emojis in there. We should not mention his name. He's Volder Corley. <laughs> Volder Corley. We'll have to show him, show him the way to the Dumbledore. So he's, uh, he's, just, he's gone to the Coolum. He's finally gone to a Coolum game to support his supposed <laughs> important partner. Supposed important partner? Well, we won't get into that. It's, that's a wide. You're just going to get us into all sorts of troubles. No troubles. He's probably, he's probably you know... As I said, there's no no animal emojis been uh, been thrown in there. He's been hacked, but I'm not sure if there is a uh, a shark one. What we need is some people to uh, give us some live footage from there to see if he's employing the Voldecoli tip to make sure he can pour in as shovel in as many chips as possible in one go. Well, isn't the entire Merchador cricket fields an old tip? He's really just getting into the spirit of Merchador. I think you're proud of yourself for that, do you? Yeah. Oh, someone's out there standing the wrong way around. If you're watching at home, you're getting coaching on the go. Anderson in. And That's beans. He's called another one. Oh, so he's he's gone. This umpire is uh, employing the he goes the, the wing, the wingspan with the wrists up at the end for the uh, the wing flaps. Yeah. The what do they call them? Winglets. Is that what they call them? Yep. It's like a triple seven with the little fold up things at the side. Ah, uh, yes. I've got no idea what you're talking about. Uh, triple sevens type of plane. Of course it uh, is. Planes uh, fly through the air just like that ball did. King of the segways here. One run taken there. And uh, speaking of runs, they also take off from runways. Mm -hmm. Need a safety strap on that guy. Ooh, left handed. Yeah, you know. Uh, it's you know get when punished. you get a full full That's toss left handed. And the crowd goes wild. That is the first boundary of the day. 
You can't bowl there to a left-hander. No. Well, you can, but you'll see what happens. So in the words of uh, Kelvin Cochran, don't bowl there. This is an easy-to-watch replay. Boom. Push cap. And then Into it just the ran shot. away. Gonski, that, that came right off the meter. Ran the away all the way to the runway. That was pretty bad, actually. Yeah, I'm still uh, flying my way through this uh, segue. Please don't continue with that. I suggest you go in for the service. Yeah. 21 runs off nine overs, two wickets down. There's a different way of doing it. All right, no new chat from Voldecorley, so we're okay. There was a score update there, though, from that other game. Three for 20. That's Coolum batting, is it, or Coolum a bowling? That's been given as a wide. That's a W. That's a wide ball, or as it was known yesterday, a wild ball. Not a movie. I do love the sound of uh, cricket spikes on concrete. Yes, they're better than cricket spikes on my back. Oh, in the air! Oh. Let's have a look at that again. Wooshka and... Just, oh. just popped out. Head back live. Okay, Underwood in. Ooh, cut shot there, but... A f double Fonzie given there. Two A's. Look, now you're just trying too hard. I've never been accused of that before in my life. Where is Dr. Dirty Dead? <laughs> Haven't seen now, him yet. Well, now that you've said his name, the universe knows that he's required and he'll be about, he'll be about the place. Ooh, taking a quick run. Should have gone to the bowler's end. Went in the middle, just to be sure. He's uh, still recovering from his uh, chloroform overdose from last night. Exactly. It was just working out the mixtures for commentary. Be great if you turned up like with a pixelated face and full cover. No one knows. Have one of those voice modulation things that makes him sound like Darth Vader. Makes you wonder if you'd venture a guess as to who he might be. Get it wrong, you're going to strike out. There we go. I believe um, one of the most recent clues after this delivery. Underwood in. Ooh, almost wound up with a left-handed shot. I believe he... Oh, going for some runs. I decided not to take another. It's a nice arm. Good arm. Thrown all the way in. Yeah, I uh, think one of the recent clues is that he's given is mm -hmm. that he's seen me batting with the kaboom, but he says he hasn't seen me bowling. That rules and a lot I, out. And, and I... Kind of played indoor with you. Yeah, I was saying that. But really? I was wondering, he, I think he has seen me bowling, just... Um, Different just, kind just of... Just not at cricket. Yeah. Puzzle on that for a while, eh? Oh! Oh! That's a good edge. I think they've uh, struck that. I believe she's got bat on that. Oh, and they've brought it through extra for a spare. All right. With an edge like that, the bowler's likely to come and bowl a bumper. One short. Well, that could only be Jackie Sparkles if there's one short. <laughs> <laughs> if we're looking out there. Hang on. No. There we go. Give myself that one. She won't mind. Maybe. Cut it. Ooh, no ball. No ball. You know what that oh, means. Close up in. on that umpire. Where's the woohoo? And here we go. And the woohoo, where is it? Oh, it was the last ball of the oh. over. Oh. Come on. That's unlucky. Deprived everyone of a woohoo. The crowd is left with bated breath, but you can get toothpaste for that. Shouldn't be eating worms anyway. You shouldn't be eating any kind of bait, really. All right. Troy Mundy now saying 
we probably need to break this partnership up. They're getting a bit lucky. Are they feeling lucky? Are they? You've got to ask yourself. I don't know what you're talking about. It is two for 28 after 10. Left-hander on strike. Bold! Bold. That's not good. There was a carryover woohoo. Yes, a little unlucky. Wicket, wicket, McBold with the ball. Hmm. Go with that one. We may have run out of uh, left-handers. <laughs> Except that maybe... See who goes out. No, they've changed the order slightly. There you go. We'll get a close up on that bold, shall we? Oh, I did that the first time. Ah, oh, very good. Speaking of wide balls, we can see everything. An incoming batter. Uh, Why don't you tell us about uh, who the incoming batter is, Maxwell? Oh, I'm going to guess it's... Uh, that looks like that's, someone from Yandina. That's Joy. Thought it might be. Young cub. A bit nervous today, she said. She advised us uh, if that she does throw up on the side of the field for nerves, that Not we should replay it. We shouldn't film it and uh, show it back to you in slow motion. That might have been us that said that we would do that. Oh, oh, hey. oh. Pete McCauley says Patman Sport has arrived. Oh, I hope he got the welcome he deserves. I wonder if he's uh, setting up his live streams from there today. It might be. I'll be doing some outside filming. Looks like we've got someone itching to join us here in the commentary box if we uh, make up some room. No, the world's not ready soon, for that. As soon as, we, uh, as soon as we mention that to anyone, they just start shaking their head at us. They shrink as away. As if to say, what do you think? We're some kind of moron like you who appreciates being on camera and people listening to what we have to say. Why is it the only sentence you can easily complete is one about yourself? Well, uh, it's just one of those, you know, self, self-deprecating, defecating, whatever the word is. Um, kind of things. We're not at Maroochydore. That was built on an old dump. Dot ball. Oh, oh, she's wound up for that one. It's kind of shut I play. A, kind week, of, a kind week beforehand and then have to adjust on the way through. It's the kind of shot that uh, maybe I used to teach her in indoor cricket. Yeah. Say, hey, that field isn't close. You swing the bat hard, they tend to disappear whether you hit the ball or not. Yeah. Played indoor cricket, did, did you? Yes. I hadn't noticed. Oh, that's a delicate shot. Into the covers. Dot ball. They're going to need to up the run rate very soon. Hmm. Well, I think they're trying. Yep, it's a good call. Kind of the long end. The long end or the wrong end? Far end. Oh, that's a wide. Two runs there. And uh, not a ball bowled. Good result. The end, Dino. That's, uh, I believe they've upped the run rate. They're, they're listening to you and thought, well, uh, we'll oblige, Lana. It well, seems if, to make sense. If he says so, let's do that. So, we've got uh, Joey Bestford back on strike. Oh, she went the whooshka on that one. Decided that she wanted to do the Steve, Steve War slog sl sweep, seeing if she could hit it over the power lines there. But you couldn't say that sentence again in the correct order. What, the Pe sweep slog war Steve? The Peter Sleep playing the slog Steve. That was one of my favourite laughs that I got last week, mentioning uh, Peter Sleep. Yeah. Oh, something happened. Turned around the corner. That could go all the way. Going to go all the way. That's a four. 
Four runs, as you can tell from the quiet crowd, they're not really being very interactive. Four, get the replay on that. Wooshka, there we go. Can we, oh, there we go, the ball's going so fast, we barely caught it. There it is, over the boundary. So it is three for 35 off 11 overs. Well, if she's nervous, she's not certainly not showing it. She's like, well, maybe I'll, maybe I'll jog those nerves out from running up and down the pitch and yeah. smashing the ball really hard. Jog them. Well, I don't think Jackie Sparkles uh, is got, appreciating it. She's, no, she's got not got a whole lot of quick singles or twos or threes. Not with those little legs. Well, she's probably uh, happy that of the Bestfords, it was uh, Joy that went out because I hear that Alissi. Basically runs where the... Yes, if there's a run there, she takes it. Yes. There isn't a run there. Don't know where she, she would have learned that. She hits the like button a lot when it comes to running. <laughs> Speaking of which... Uh, looks like we've got a bowling change. Oh, what's going on there? Are they running? Watch out, there's an arm there. It's a bar. Jackie's just uh, complaining about the bowling, saying, mm -hmm, bowl it more where my bat is. Right, just seeing if we've got the new bowler in. Ah. It's coming on with a different bowling action. Well, if there's one thing about her, she's... Uh, Don't say it. Done her research? No, she's oh. um, just got more variety than most. Oh, more variety than your puns, that's for sure. A wide. Good, good bit of keeping, though. Just needing to do a bit more, I think, the bowler. That wasn't canned laughter, that was people elsewhere. Full toss. Oh, oh I think their lucky left hand is no longer there. That would have been a joy to hit. Dot. Dad joke! We've doubled our dad joke quotient from last week already. Oh, we need, need to make oh. up. Need to make up for uh, certain people not being in the chat. Uh, Macaulay says three for 46 off 11 at Coolum. That is Voldecauley, he who should not be mentioned. I'm not going to remember that, let alone be able to say it. Exactly. Oh, she's been uh, trying that shot the whole over. She's going to get contact at one point for sure. And it was quite close to the fielder in there. One second. Joy on to uh, five runs already. It's the end of the 12th over. Making that three for 38 off 12. Watch local, be local, play local, support local. Your advert here. This advert's brought to you by Telestream.tv. And you lost your chance. I'll remember it in about six overs. Yeah, well, that'll be the next ad break then, I suppose. Mid-pitch conference, what do you reckon they're talking about? I'm not sure. Jackie's saying, Jackie's saying do I ah, need to put the glove back on? It's a new it's a new batter. I can use the same speech I used the last time. I was talking to Scotty. Go, Joy. One of those quick singles, please. Cameraman's also done, done the exact same thing. If I was a wicket keeper, I'd just be singing lullabies behind Jackie Sparkles there. She'd just nod <laughs> off. Right, 
That one's turned for one. Oh, a big wind up. Batter up, batter up, batter up. Now it's wide. It's going to be wide. No run taken. No. None. It's nave. Luckily, nothing happened there. Oh, careful of the moon ball. That's well hit. One taken, the legs going 100 miles an hour. That's one. Full toss, that's four runs. Oh, it's no, fielder. fielder back there. Fielder just came out of nowhere. My peripheral vision. Almost like there's a big screen in the road. <laughs> oh, fielded. Just one. And I believe that's the end of the over. Over, end of. It's the end of that over. I do believe that's going to be three for 43 of 13 overs. Maybe, might be lucky. Yes. Approaching the halfway mark. It's gonna be hard to work this out because there's a spike in Yandina's batting that comes along with a K Matthews mm. going to the crease. Well, I was just going to say, uh, Mick Moldermort has just uh, put in that they're now four down over at Coolum. McCullum we'll Mort. Boulder Corley. Okay. More coming into bowl again. Yes, they've kept more on. Oh, turned around the corner almost left handedly. Oh, big throw to the other end. Well done. One taken. Ooh, some field changes. Moving point in a lot closer. And then walking out with the bowler. Oh, oh bold. Bowler Unlucky. Wicket, wicket, McBold in cricket. Yeah, I'm happy with that. I don't know what you're talking about. I think that bit unlucky us, there. Brings us to four for 44. Ah, yes, someone's not standing on one leg or something. Let's take a look at that again. Four for 44 is Richie's cousin who lives one street over. And Bushka might have chopped that on. Oh, I think you're right. Yeah, yes. I heard it. Chopped it. Chopped it on. Unlucky. Got got battle ball. Just not in the direction they were wanting. Thank you for that insight again, Maxwell. There's people around the world. Glad that you're here. Do what I can. Thanks for having me. Glad to be here. Speaking of people around the world, if you're around the world and you're not Volder Corley. A couple of times or maybe more. Seen the thoughts and, the and, and, your, and the delights of 
the occasional foreign shore. But if it's, anyone asks uh, you... It's Jackie out for 10. If anyone asks you the favourite... Uh, I'm sorry. Cricket I've, channel that you adore. I haven't been listening to you at all for the last minute. If you said something. No? That's what I thought. All right, so we've got to play without a number. That can only be one person. Tammy McCord. Because every Yandina team must have a McCord and a parent. I think every every team on the, the coast. on the coast has got to have a parent. Well, they nearly do. She's way too zen, apparently. See how chill she is out there. Well, maybe she'll uh, counterbalance Joy. Maybe. I mean the person, not just, you know, oh, Joy in general. It's just I'm the not, emotion in I'm, and of itself. I'm not talking about some sort of inside-out thing going on. You're going to... Yodge. You're going to get yourself in trouble. I'm referring again to a Pixar film. Mm -hmm. Always with the film references. Yeah, that's all I do. Ooh, oh, a great cut shot. Classy shot. Take it off the mark of the one. Cameraman is jealous. Big arm. Only thing missing from that was the front foot lifted in the air. Did we get the front foot lifted in the air? Oh, I think so. Who knows? Wasn't quite the proper forehand, but... A uh, bit, of, bit of top spin on it. Might have had the European grip. Match grip. Oh, oh, that's been well hit. They seem to have someone exactly where they need to be. I'm taken. More in. Well played. Another good cut shot. And well run as well. Yeah, both, uh, both seem to be very on the ball with the, uh, the running between the wickets here. Nice. I wasn't sure you were going to make it through that, but well done. You got there in the end. So did they? It's a single. It's a single. Yeah. It's a single bear. I'm just uh, doing what I can to support the uh, snakes. Four for 47 off 14 overs. Any culture teams playing today? <laughs> Unknown. <laughs> Coming up to drinks after this one, I reckon. Oh, we might have to get some updates on what's happening around the grounds. There's only one other match <laughs> played today. One other game where Volta Corley is letting us know what's happened. Maybe a detailed report of what's happening. Well, he's sounding like a good night out there, saying uh, four down now. Hmm. Well, there's only hope and faith that everything will go well. Looking for the bowler, and there she was hiding behind the umpire. Oh, saved a wide. But you get one off the bat. Well done, Tammy. There's one. Now, I'm thinking this is definitely a bowling change. <laughs> the bowler is P. McCauley. <laughs> what? This is the P. McCauley we're allowed to mention. Oh, okay. <laughs> Don't get too excited up there in Coulomb. Oh. oh, the wicket ball. Trouble was brewing there. That's a dot. That was, I don't know if our wide camera was, uh, was wide enough to see just how high that went. That's like the catch that I, um, well, it wasn't a catch yesterday. No, it wasn't a catch. Neither time you had a crack at it. Oh. Not afraid to uh, use the feet and come down the pitch to it, so that's good. Do you teach her that, T-Max? Um, no. Yeah, I don't think so. I don't really come down the pitch to it. Well, I mean, I'm usually already two feet down the pitch. Mm -hmm. That's the one. That's a bit flatter. They'll take an easy one there. Well fielded. Well run. 
One of the total. So around about 50 at drinks. Couple of balls to come. And the way they're running between the wickets, as long as they get bat on ball. Oh, that's Boulder. Yes, square legs said, yep, that went through and bulgy. A little unlucky there. I'd say they'll probably take drinks down. Well, got a replay new, on someone that. Someone hasn't told the new batsman that. Okay. Got a replay well, on that one. Well, let's go for a replay then. See what happened. The uh, nice, nice side on view of that. Oh. Maybe the other camera. Oh, just tickled the bail off by the look of it. Again, that height just going underneath the bat. Yep, dropped under the bat. And just, oh, just, just onto the, the side stumps. of the stumps. So there's one ball to go in the over. That is drinks, 5.49, or 14.5. Mm. Five down. They can't be too And happy the wind, about that. wind is picking up here. Luckily, we're in an outdoor area. So it shouldn't be too much of a bother for me. Well, we are uh, still a little concerned about our concrete bungalow. So a quick rundown of the scores. Uh, Perrin with Quackmire. Linda with Quackmire. I think that's two weeks in a row. Unfortunate. Jackie Sparkles, 11. Uh, K. Scott, 6. And Joy Westford, 10 not out off 12. And Tammy McCord just bowled then, 3 off 4. That's actually better than most of our kitchen sinks because it's like, yeah. well, one, you I said it. I was doing it, yeah. yeah. <laughs> and, uh, and second, the information is uh, readable. And uh, bowling, a uh, Lindsay, Rex, three overs. One, one maiden. maiden. Two for two. That's pretty good with one wide. So one off the bat. Uh, oh, three overs, that's very good. Yeah, D Moore, four overs, one maiden. One for seven. Uh, Underwood, 2.4 overs. None for 16. None for 16. I'm guessing there's a uh, bold in there that's uh, not gone on that, so that'll be 2.5 overs. One for 16. But that's Macaulay bowling there. One point. Yep, I'm not sure what's going on with the scoring. We'll, well just leave we'll, that. Uh, <laughs> we'll, uh, we'll just ask the scoring desk. Ah, there's no one there. That could be what's going on. <laughs> there we go. You leave it undertended. The rats get in. Damn. There you go. Um, any other games going on, Maxwell, that you've uh, got any info for? Well, there, I believe. I believe there's another match going on. I'm gonna I believe there's a match. Let's I'm see just, uh, if they're live scoring it, shall we? Well, let's find out. We're about to find out. We're using technology. Ah. Coolum versus Caloundra from 9.45 a.m. From 9.45? 9.45 a.m. Ah. Um, Coolum Parisian Sports Complex from Cargill Oval. Um, no result. Thanks for that. You really built that up. Thought I would. Built that up real well. Well, I'm guessing that Fred's up there. Fred might give us a better breakdown than uh, Peter Voldecorley can. I'm thinking. Now, before anyone thinks we're playing the game, uh, what's Max eating? It's not Max. And you can probably tell that because I'm uh, on camera. Yeah. I'm not making any <coughs> sounds. Yeah, I wouldn't do such a thing. You'd think our rigging crew would use this time to tape down every wire that's attached to anything anywhere. Well, the umpires are on their way back out. They must be heading to the bowls club for the same happy hour. Nope. Oh, I've remembered. Wait, I go to this end. You go to that end. I didn't do the uh, switch. Oh, no, we're out of... Uh, we're, didn't we're, do the switcheroo. We're, we're past the uh, Matrix references. <laughs> McCauley says... Sorry, McVoldemort. McVold However you want to go with that. Dark Lord of the Swans. 
Don't tell me well, he's one would say, this. One would say Black Swan with uh, four for 65 at the halfway mark. Patman's yeah. Pat tuned in as well. Greetings, Greetings from Coolum. Coolum four for 65 or 15. Greetings Drinks. from Yandina. Hmm. Right back at you. And uh, luckily, uh, Peter Voldecorley, probably standing right beside him, uh, saw him type it, went, oh, I better let them know it's four for 65 at the halfway mark. Thanks, always on the ball. But, you know, there's things you can do about that to make things... How far behind better. is that? Not far oh. at all. <laughs> Well, speaking of uh, behind, we should probably uh, head somewhere out to the middle. Do you think? Do you? It's a lucky punk. I usually don't. Back to the middle. I think that was caught. So, That's on a hat trick. It's not ideal. It's on a Patrick. No, some crazy member of the crowd's trying to talk to us. I don't know what they're saying. <laughs> they're rambling about something. Uh, that's the way things go. Ah, uh, that's a wicked, wicked McSchmigger. Cameraman telling us they uh, don't think he got that one, and that's disappointing because I can now blame it on him that I didn't record it either. <laughs> <laughs> it was all well, he, all their fault. Well, when you're both back from holidays, feel free to join us. It'd be nice to have you here. Nothing? No? No, no. No, I'm not back from <laughs> holidays yet. I was just trying to work out if, uh, if Jackie Sparkle's I got I do believe, got though, out. if that was the first ball. Oh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> Quackmire's joined a band. <laughs> yes. Okay. Is it both Bestfords? So uh, we didn't really have much time to tell you about the incoming and outgoing bats person. It was uh, Louise Hayko. Apparently the London contingent is watching, so um, hopefully you didn't get up to make a cup of tea because you've just missed her innings. <laughs> Or well, maybe they'll tune in for the commentary. <laughs> <laughs> All right, geezer, in it. How's that? Oh, we'll still at home. <laughs> uh, if we were going to do the British commentary, we'd have to be complaining about stuff a lot, wouldn't we? Those Australians, it's just not fair. They're beating it. Here what we go. is it about the English in Australia that they just seem to get out, and not make many runs? Here we go, team hat trick. Oh. Ah, Why? decided to go for a different W. Yeah, and uh, the question. I don't know what I've recent, rec recently written. What yeah, I've good words. recently eaten, but uh, big words. I think there's Max, a well. bit of a bit of bad taste in my mouth. That maybe that last uh, couple of sentences that I spat out, possibly. So, if that was wide, does that mean this is still a live ball and it could be a team hat trick? Well, not anymore. Well, if it's another wide. Oh, uh, he had the wings um, out and everything. Umpire's used up his quota. Decided, wing, he's that's holding nothing. one back for the end of the over, I think. Three more balls, then he'll call another one. It's only around the third or four, fourth ball of the over. He calls the second wide. Um, yeah, you might need to do some deciphering in the chat. Uh-oh. There we go. Oh. That's been given as a no ball. Oh. In on the umpire, in on the Quick, umpire. Get it on the umpire. Oh, we've missed it. We've missed the woohoo. It's like, you're back from your holiday, but not everyone is. Let's go with the one. Oh, yeah. I think there might be a chippy tip going on. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so bum today? Maybe it's one of those, uh, one of those London geezers. Maybe. 
Boom. And they're speaking some weird language English. Boom. Well, Calder and Park. Calder on Park. Sounds like a dog racing track. If you're a person. Max didn't mean that. Next, next you're going to say all complaints to, uh, to Max at telestream.tv. Well, Calder on Park could maybe be um, a Korean viewer. Um, could maybe just be a, a real person's name. I've heard that happens sometimes on YouTube. No ball very early. Maybe they uh, overstepped, just like you're doing. He called that before she was even in the delivery stride. They're confirming no ball, dead ball. No ball, dead ball, because he punched her in the guts as she came past. Yeah, fair enough. So is that Noble dead ball one run? Well, I didn't signal the woohoo. No. Probably why they're appealing. Not too much pad in that one for an LBW. Since when did that matter? Well, I'd say not much bad in that for a court behind. You could say I the same the, thing, Maxwell. I get the feeling there's some buses that are coming my way. All the way to Kur Kuroi yesterday is where those buses are going. <laughs> All right. Here we go for a... No one knows what's happening. Oh, turn it's around well the hit. corner. Going to have to get down. Oh, missed field. That's going to yes. go all the way. You've got to get down to those ones. They can take funny bounces. Like when Max is bowling. Let's have a look at this. Bit short. Wooshka. Around the corner. Ah, uh, didn't do any bridging there. I think they're going to war out there. Some war cries going on. Drill sergeant getting them ready. Short. Ooh. It's always nice when they're nice and loud out in the middle. This is Smith. Means we don't have to do much commentary. Oh, Olivia Smith. Yes. Good name. Talk us through this. Oh, she's decided he was probably going to stick his arm out and put her off again. Any fun facts for Olivia? Well, why don't you tell me? You're the one that can't read. Apparently she's a cannon. Nope. That's the person above. No, that's the under. Not sure if I believe what's written here. It might be right. Mum left her at netball at five years old. Lives in Harvey Bay. 16. Big women's cricket fan. Mm. Some word that I can't read. All players by number. There we go. So it's six for 56 off 16. That's all the sixes required. Speaking of sixes, we haven't had one today. Well, we're not in Sydney. No, that was ta no. Dad joke. <laughs> Actually, that's Dad joke. Uh, that was not a. <laughs> May have been a dad joke. All right, Rex is back on. Bring some order to things, including the commentary booth where Max is just off the chain. Oh, you're the one that's out of order. Turn around. And Alicia Bestford deciding, oh, there's a run there. So she started running. One run taken. <laughs> All right, it's the Bestford Express out there. What's going to happen here, Max? Talk us through it. Um, it's going to be an edge to slip. 
Leg slip. Yep. By edge, you mean off the front of the bat? Well, didn't hit the middle of the bat because it's surrounded by the edges. What would you know about the middle of the bat? I was batting with you yesterday. Hey, I got one out of the middle. Yeah, well, I suppose we'll see a slow motion replay with Chariots of Fire music in the background of that next week, will we? Well, just the one. <laughs> 0.25 speed. Ball tracking, apparently. Uh, I don't know if you could see the ball on Ooh. the oh, Playing it very close to the in-close fielders. Hit it on the up. If well, they had been slightly to their left, they uh, might have been able to stop that. That's why we've got you here for the expert insight, Maxwell. Uh, I'm throwing myself <laughs> under the bus with that. I feel like if that had been a wicket, Yandina would have been one more down. <laughs> I feel if they had to run an extra run there, they'd probably be on a high score. There's facts being spat out here. <laughs> right, please save us in the chat. Give us something else to talk about. Oh, it's well played. Oh, turn that around the corner. Between the two fielders. Gone, gone for one there. For one. Oh, Lissy Bestford. Lissy's like, there's not there's, one there, so we should run. run. We should definitely take another Max one. Max would have run that. <laughs> yes, he'd be back in the pavilion after running that. How's the stream going, people? Let us know. Well, apparently still water getting through. Still water? Yep. Not sparkling. Glad there's no rushing water or flood water getting through. That's a good ball. Good pace. I did notice fun facts for uh, Joy Bestford. It did say... That's on the other page there. Just said, no, nope, it's on this page. It's on this page. I can't read anyway. Correct. Uh, as young cub, happy, happy, joy, joy. Yeah, young cub. It's like I said that. You didn't say the happy, happy, joy, joy part. Well, we say it every time. Oh, here we go. She's back easily. Well runs. Good runsing. And it's been given his leg boys. I just put it on the score. It's all that bothers me. And you still get it wrong. What? I believe it's 6 for 61. 2 is what I said. <laughs> I rest my case up against this wall. Well, it's a nice big black case that I've got here, just in case the stream <laughs> crashes. It's the black box that, uh, that records everything. I think it's got wheels on it. You just hop in it and drive away and blame got, someone else. Got the flight data in there. <laughs> I've been told it's shark proof, but I... Uh, I don't haven't, haven't actually uh, decided we've, I'd test that. We've been to Coolum though, with it. Yeah. Well, it survived. It did. Speaking actually, I don't think it did. When we were streaming at Coolum, everything died. It did indeed. Uh, yet to pull out the flight uh, data from that one. Actually, that's true. They're still waiting on that stream. Hey. Don't. Uh, if only you had some time. Time? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Alright, here we go. It's been Wooshkin for one. Just sneaking it past the in-close fielder there. That was like a sweep on drive. An on-sweep. I think Karoy quite leg sweep? rightly. No. There we go. They do both play like they should be left-handers. Everything it does seem to just be turned around the corner off the legs. Around the corner. I think Karoy would be, have to be very happy at the uh, run rate and the uh, wickets at the moment. No wonder they're chirpy out there. Hmm. I was thinking if these two had both play like left-handers, I'm not sure where they would have picked that up from. Well, you can't claim anything. Ah, uh, see, they were true left-handers, they would have hit that. Well, they're not true left-handers, they're batting right-handed. Again with they, the insight. They may have just picked finished up the... that sentence. They may have just picked... Well, I well, would have finished it if you didn't interrupt. Oh, well, that doesn't Jeez. help anyone's humour, does it? I, yeah, now, now, I can't, now I can't actually remember what I was saying. You can't and you've got to blame it on me 
when it was yep. your fault. That's why people tune in. To hear half of your sentences. Sometimes they could put a couple of streams together, play them back to back and get some quality commentary. That'll be a wad. This is Olivia. Can't remember the last name, it's a bit hard to say. Smith. Oh, top edge. Landing safe. Oh, a bit of spin on it. One run. Joy moves to 15. Let's see on seven. Well, I think the sound wave from someone's catch yesterday uh, <laughs> just joined us. Oh, oh, that's in the air. It's probably going to be right in the middle. Yeah. Another one landing safe. Well, I seem to be going about a run of ball at the moment. I know for me personally, if I wanted to run a ball, that would last about two and a half overs before I fell over. <laughs> prefer to hit it. And prefer to go for four runs after every four balls, do you? Yes, lean on it and just go, what's going on there? Ah, see? Well fielded. I was uh, proven right, where if the fielder was a little bit to the one side, then they'd stop it. Mm -hmm. I don't think I can take all of this knowledge being downloaded straight into me. We're back to make Matrix references, eh? Kung uh, Fu? I know cricket. <laughs> Wait, no, I don't. Oh, oh wallop. Well done. She got behind that one. Another solid left-handed shot there. That's the end of... Your my sentence? My scoring oh, career. What's, what's the matter? You... I just looked down and realised that we were one ball into the next over. That can't be right. Another game going on somewhere? Oh, I believe so. There's uh, something going on at uh, Coolum. And we're picking up audio from that, are we? Possibly. Yeah. I'll put it to you, sir, that you are a big liar. I don't know where that came from. Fibonacci sequence going on there. Game not happening at Coolum that we're picking up audio from. All right, now I, I was referring to some noise from yesterday's match. This will be the hat trick ball. Ah, looks like the scorers have fixed up. The uh, yeah, I noticed that. We've got 1.6 overs for one person. Oh, moon ball coming back. Moon ball, moon ball, caught. Oh. Ooh. There we go. Decided to stand back, let it bounce, and then go, oh, that actually bounces quite high. Yep. So I can turn it around the corner. Joy says, I'm not having any truck with that. I'm playing a shot. It's a term. It's probably found at the end of a sentence. That's why you wouldn't have heard it or used it much, Max. All right. It's so actually dropped a, dropped a forearm onto that one. It's only got two arms. let that hang out there so people can realise how terrible it was. There we go, and whack. And they're running. I've noticed something. If you watch when Alyssa runs, she's played a lot of indoor because she runs the first... First half of the first pitch? First half of the pitch really quick, and then it goes, oh, there's Oh, that's more. right, this is a full <laughs> pitch, isn't it? Oh. Damn it, there's more of it. It just keeps going. Oh, that's been well hit. Through the infield. They've got three fielders in a very tight little um, V down there, down on the league side. They're doing well. Stopped quite a lot of fours. I think uh, I think their field placings have been very good. They seem to know where the where the where the batter's wanting to send the ball, and they put a fielder there. 
It's good cricket, really. It's crazy. I thought the idea was you move someone to wherever the ball went every time. Whoosh ya! And again. If you did that, Mano, I'd most be, of your fielders would be out of the game. <laughs> they'd be sitting in gardens and in other places. No, it's, it's other people from other places that do that. Right. It's fun batting, though, when you've got a captain that chases the ball. They, you hit it somewhere, they move someone there. You hit it where they just move the person from, they put them back again. Hit it back that in is, the other that place. Is, that is um, a joy to do. He's on strike. Looks like they're just uh, doing up her Grosby rips there. And Velcro's come undone. So chat's uh, slowed up a little bit. Let us know what's happening. Where are you? What are you watching this on? Where's Bubba? Where's Bubba watch? Up a gump. That should be over. Oh, I make that six for 74. We're about to find out. All right, 11 overs left. Big discussion in the middle of the pitch there. What are you having for tea tonight? I don't know. I thought you were making it. Well, I didn't put anything out. Damn, we'll have to get takeaway again. Pizza? Penny, there was a pizza in Yandina that opened at breakfast. At the crack of cameraman getting here at 8.30. I, I thought they'd paid their penance for that. Actually, it's 7.45. I've dropped it back. They're not going to pass them. Uh, Olivia coming into ball. Bushka. Smith. Oh. Uh, on your Smithy. Big open bowling. Up to 100. <laughs> like the one last year with um, 70. Oh, okay. Loud. Sorry about that. It's gone for four. We just had to be sure. We had Collie Hawkins standing under one of our uh, effects mics. You can never be sure what's going to happen there. It's got a bit of spice in the vocabulary. Olivia. Ooh. Going for the uh, the full wide uh, ball and full wide experience. Hasn't, uh, I don't know what the plan was, but I don't think it came off on that delivery. Well, if it was you tiring you out trying to hit it. I'm not the one that swung and missed about 15 times yesterday. That's lies, scandal, spurious accusations. Oh. It looked like it might, might have been a good one to hit straight. Over the bowler. Over the bowler. Uh. Yeah, not to the bowler. <sighs> That's what I did wrong. Yeah. It's all right, I'm sure we'll have a great slowed down replay of that in 0.25 speed two or three times in your next helmet cam. Good ball. Speaking of next helmet cams, um, how are you going with yours? Just building up enough footage to release it as a movie what for Christmas. I literally had that after one innings. <laughs> Wouldn't have been a very interesting movie. No. Well, I don't know. If you include the uh, footage of whatever batsman you're batting with. That's how it, that's how it became uh, movie length. Well, you need to tell a story, don't you? Oh, that's well hit. Oh, it's gone through. Oh, That'll be four. That's a four. Certainly got some pepper on it when they hit it. 
They've done well. Well hit there. And another misfield. Yes. Again, Karoo Yamandi got the fielders in the right place, but uh, it's a little bit unlucky with... Uh, not quite getting down all the way. Some of the bounce and things like that. Well, going the outfield on. here, you've got to get down to it because it can bobble and go under your hand and jump to the right or left. I feel it here many times. Oh, in the air slightly. Okay. She was trying to replicate you from yesterday. Bushka with the throw. That's 20 overs down, 6 for 86. Decent run rate. Four point three. Yeah. Just double checking. Double checking? Yeah, I had one. I thought you can never be too sure. I mean if you've only got one poultry result, you want to make sure you get two, don't you? Check it up against everything. Alright. Ah, we've had the run the drinks out with a special message. I wonder if the coach could tell us what the special message was. I believe the special message was... Uh, <laughs> Don't get out. ...was uh, slide the bat, Alyssi, was, <laughs> was one of the things that I heard. That came from deep in the dressing room, along with snores, probably. Okay, back to it here. Oh, it's the ball that hides behind the umpire. Oh, moon ball. Oh, straight. She uh, took a few steps back there, which yeah. really meant uh, she had to run a little bit extra. <laughs> it's well fielded. Good fielding. This is the only true Macaulay. All other P Macaulays don't count. Only this P Macaulay. Ah, we've had Bubba G tune in. Ah. Yes, we know Bubba. The weather chair is gone. Literally gone. Apparently, it got cancelled midweek by YouTube. <laughs> it was saying some controversial things in our stream. And oh, I uh, believe it was out there social distancing, and now it's uh, it's done its quarantine. Going, oh, it's being part of a uh, sofa family. Is it enjoying Freedom Day like Kylie is? Oh, that was a good back away cut shot. Straight down the ground. Ticking, ticking, ticking it over. And uh, McMoldermort has uh, tuned in with 6 for 95 off 20. Mm. It's pretty neck and oh. neck with what's going on here. Is that another did, misfield? Or? Did we ever work out who was actually um, batting up there at Coolum? I all we're getting is um, this I don't is know, the, the only team that well, the only team that's been mentioned so far is um, the Swans. It's true. McCallumort needs to be a bit better. Oh, there we go. That's going to be well four hit. runs. That's back very away. well hit. Oh, is it going to be cut? Oh no. Flipped it up onto themselves. Tried everything they could there. Great effort in the field. Now that was a variation of the cut shot, which uh, my key to cricket, um, it doesn't include that. That was the back away forehand, really, if you watch it. <laughs> Scooped it over the top. Oh. All unlucky there. She was down. Moon. Wooshka. She tried it again. Straight down the ground. Well fielded. Well done. 
Unlike other Macaulays we know, that one was no runs going through well, there. Well, I was thinking the height of the uh, the loopy bowling is quite similar to the uh, the other the other Macaulay Vought. Yeah, Volder Corley. Well, you got Loopy right when it comes to him. Coldemort. Yes. Six for 95 off 21. You got to wonder if they've got Kez just getting warmed up over there, punching a punching bag, getting ready to come out. You know, we need <laughs> we need to uh, talk about some other members of the uh, of that particular lineup so well, that they, so they can so that Volder Corley. Yes. Well, we were going to talk about Linda, but she wasn't there long enough to talk too much about. <laughs> Hang on. There's the bus. <laughs> I was crossing now back to the end of my sentence. Right. Let's join that live, shall we? <laughs> I think Ian Dina were very clever in uh, getting some bat batters out of the way to get Team Bestford out there. <laughs> oh, that was gone through again. This is like doing a Thames boat tour, going under all the bridges we're seeing here today. Oh, Karoi must have quite a lot of uh, squad here today because they've got at least two or three subfield is at the ready at any time. If only we had that at Nambour. Our subfielders are usually five years old and not allowed to field. Oh, it's in the air and going to be short. There we go. One taken. I think that's 100 up. Six for 100. Anderson in. She swapped ends. Oh, that was a good length. Just dropping down to a Yorker length. Very tough to play. They've run one. Leg by or off the bat? Uh, well, umpire's not really uh, doing much out there, so I'm going to assume oh, by the off time, the bat. By the time you looked up, he could have done a happy dance for all you knew. What are you talking about? Mm, move along. Nothing to see here. So, uh, Joy's on 31 from 36. That's well played. Just waited oh. on it, played it around the corner. Slight misfields. <laughs> and again, we have uh, some music antics going on <laughs> behind one of our cameras. Jolly japery. <laughs> <laughs> Confusion abounds. With nature's gift. <laughs> Gert. Oh, oh I thought that was going to be bold for a second. Anyone else, they're chopping that on. That's what happens when you're cutting off middle. Premeditated cut off middle. All right, joint strike. Alyssa's uh, catching. She's 23 off 19. Wouldn't it be terrible if... Don't you finish that sentence. <laughs> you're Karoy and you, you think, oh, finally, one of them retired because they had too many runs and out comes Kez. <laughs> <laughs> that may have been the message. <laughs> um, pick up the run rate, so oh, when yep. Kez comes out, it just keeps going. Yep. And not only that, she keeps pushing herself down the order. There's still Olsen, Holstein and Kylie Taylor. She, I mean, she's not good for much, but she'll probably be entertaining, she says. She does say that, so it's, it's acceptable. Uh, again, the uh, wind 30, 40 metres above us is picking up. That's dropped. It was 80 metres before. Well, the hot air balloons. Luckily, though, um, losing its dare I say it, the aliens haven't popped in today. I might just go do a little bit of producing myself, which is not any kind of producing. Oh, I say, leaving me here all by myself. I uh, heard that. They're wanting to know how many overs are. 
exactly that doesn't know I'm not doing anything I'm just staying away from him for a while <laughs> yeah Oh, another well-played shot. I'm back. Did you miss me? From outer space. Yes. Just walked in to see you here. No, you, if you're gonna do, <laughs> if you're gonna do musical references, you've got to choose songs that we like. <laughs> oh, I don't know. I don't know now. I, I don't know the moves to the Macarena. Oh, straight cut. So I hope you're keeping up with the scoring while I was gone. Um, no. I'll take it's that almost as almost like you could uh, talk to the uh, scorers just over there. Well, that doesn't get so the... It's not like I'm just sitting here doing nothing. Well, to be fair, you were just sitting there doing nothing. I don't know what you're talking about. We're just listening, listening in on conversations. Yes. Letting the uh, scorers know what was being said oh, out in the middle. there to be hit. Oh, no ball. That means a woohoo. Oh, wonder. Where's a woohoo? Have we, had, wonder. we captured one? There it is. Yeah. Hey. There's the woohoo. That's what we love. Everyone getting into the woohoo. There it is. Wag it! Wag it! Wag it! But you can get right out. Oh, a nice pickup in the outfield there. Straight, to, straight to hand. Whoosh. Straight back in. Whooshka mabushka. Are you saying these words as though they mean something? Ah, looks like they're changing to around the wicket. They're not even left-handed. Around the wicket, Schmeggett. That's got ice on it. Oh, and cut away just for the single, it looks. Cut down safely for Juan. Well, Lissy looks like she's keen for two. I was saying that as a joke. <laughs> I didn't know what actually happened. She turned and was ready to go. Joy on 35, Felicity on 26. It's been a good partnership. Oh, it's well hit. Punched, got to the fielder a bit too quickly. They're getting down to it on this side of the field. Mm -hmm. Just one. I'm wondering if it's a 50 balls they have to retire at. Well, uh, from what I can see, Joy's up to 41. Yes. It'll be 42 after that last one, possibly. Possibly. <laughs> Wonder what Karoy Umundi's thinking about the uh, <laughs> bit of a. <laughs> Sorry, I lost the train of that sentence because uh, someone was ducking behind cameras. Yes. Not in front of them. Wooshka! Oh, yeah, run him, run him, run him, run him, run him, run him! Slide your bat! Oh, we're looking for two. We're turning. Surely uh, she's... It was, uh, was, uh, was so close to being a second run there. <laughs> she's got the ball in her hand, cocked back, about to throw, and Alyssi's putting the bat in, turning and going, surely there's another one. Yeah, there's got to be one there. Come on. Julie's younger and uh, quicker than me. Yes. She's coming to this end. I don't mind. I'm at the other end. <laughs> and they're not throwing to where I'm running. Six for 111 off 23 overs. Now, we might, we might let our crowd attendant over there let people know that they don't have to duck down behind the camera because it's facing this way. Although it's amusing to watch them, so maybe not. <laughs> had someone duck down to go underneath the microphone. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, wow, that, that hot air balloon's really lost its heat. <laughs> That's like people that get out of helicopters and duck down when the, the rotors are eight and a half feet above them. Like, oh, yep, I am five foot five. Don't want to get sucked up into it. All right, yeah. who we got bowling now? This is Anderson, I believe. Because that's how helicopters work. Those things suck up. They do. That's what people think. That's why they're ducking down. Anderson. <gasps> oh. Oh. Dottage. Good advice coming from the skipper over there. Yeah. She's doing what she can to find a phone booth. Uh, Bubba G. Just uh, telling me to check out how Mel Shelley did yesterday playing in the men's comp. We I've, saw I've it. I've already seen it. <laughs> oh. Well, there's one run there. 
Well, we might uh, we might go through that uh, just for funsies. We, we <laughs> Is she going to join us at some stage? She might do, actually. We might get her in the second innings. She's over there. We'll get her in. She likes putting the cans on the bonts and the mic in the mouth. There <laughs> we go. I'll pay that one. Oh, she's oh. bowling good length there. Again, turned around the corner. Well, it's uh, potentially some of the worst switching I've done all day. Apologies. <laughs> it's all right. Both angles look very similar. Well, they do at the moment. Unless you cut to us. Don't do that. People are going to fall off their horse. Apologies to anyone who's watching this live stream on a horse. They didn't fall off the horse. They've <laughs> fallen off the bandwagon. There was never anyone on the bandwagon. Well, maybe the band was. Don't, even, don't, they, don't they, even finish the sentence. It was going to be bad. <laughs> we'll just assume that that was bad. We'll give you one of them. Yeah, and we'll move on. How about that? We, right. need, we need some points thing. Yeah. For people responsible for the dad jokes. We need an adjudicator. That's what we need. Uh, we've got the foot down to that one. One that they, they Yep, looks like they are running. And go, slide, slide, slide. Oh, and Delissi's no, going for more. No, they're going for a third. Go to the bowler's end. I don't know that that was the ball hitting the stumps, was it? I don't know. It's going to take a little while to get through that <laughs> replay. <laughs> there was a lot going on there. Why <laughs> might just have to go through this whole thing in slow motion. I refer Look at camera two. So, I'm first bit of footsie um, fielding. Right, yes, we got that. Nice throw in. Probably could have been a wicket right there, but she's gone and thrown to the other end, which was missed. Probably could have been a wicket there. And then Alyssi's like, oh, ball's a metre and a half from the stump, so might as well run. Well, I'll, I'll give you the, uh, the fun facts on Alyssi. Uh, Mama Bear, Energizer battery, that's for sure. If there's a run, she'll take it. If there's not a run, she'll take it. Well, I think that summed everything up right just, there and then. Just seeing, that's, as I say, seeing about whether or not the ball. See, I think that yeah. was. Yeah, no, I think, the, I think their hand came around came behind around the, the ball. Back and the ball hit it. Yeah. Good work. So they, they get two of those runs, though. That's one of those, yeah. That's one of those balls that's like, well, not much more could have happened. No. So going out now is... Number five. I'm number five, which... Uh, doesn't look like Kez. No, that's uh, it's Olsen. Magic hands. Ah. Olsen. -son. Got a gammy knee. Variable f performance. I feel that, that sounds a bit like me. Yes. yes. I've got gammy performance, variable knee. All right, so that's uh, it's Alyssi, 28 of 26. Very good partnership. And the younger is still out there. 39 of 44. Not far off the retiring. Um, scoreboard says that we're in the 24th over. Which seems to match what uh, Lana's put up on your screen. So, yes, if I have a feeling the universe is going to collapse, and uh, are the umpires not following this live stream? Live stream out there? Oh, I don't know. Must be putting uh, bets on the horses. That's probably what happened. Someone fell off the horse before, and the confused the umpire. And for those playing along, uh, you can guess what I'm eating <laughs> or drinking. On throw. I mean, you've gone very quiet over there, Lano. Oh, that's just gone through. They've appealed for something because it wasn't hit around the corner for one. The umpires, not sure what over they're in. They've just called over. Have you asked it? Six for one, 16 off 24, six overs to go. Yeah, that's what they said. That's what's been happening here. 
I believe that's uh, seven, uh, seven wickets down, Lono. It's all right. Well, good thing we've got a statistician in the back of the booth. You getting you getting information that I'm not getting again? Yep. Oh. Just like I get jokes. Something's just being spelt out to you, and I'm like, I can't decipher this code. I don't know what you're saying. What's this code? Sorry, I can't follow that. Uh, one more wicket. No, I don't understand. No. No, two overs to go. Ah, so block. Is that what you're saying? <laughs> that kind of thing. <laughs> Funny, a bus is going past here today. Well, it's on the bus route from Karoi. Oh, it looks like we're back to the opening bowler. The opening bowler is the bowler. Ooh, Ooh that was a good ball. Threw the shot a little early and uh, I think it hit her on the, on the shoulder. Well, let's have a look. Good bounce on that. Oh, no. Top of leg. In the midsection. Don't rub it. That's close to the shoulder. Now, for most. Can I mention that I'm blind? So is this Olivia uh, back up the other end? I thought, I don't know. Don't ask me technical questions. <laughs> How well, am I supposed to know these things? I don't know, because I'm sure she's bowled at least three overs, but according to things, not. That'll be uh, wide. Yep. You can tell by the little step, shuffle step, he starts going. Ah, oh, it's a bit windy. <laughs> the whole Hawken family here together today. All right. The only thing missing now is rain. Oh, no rain chair. Take a rain check, though. Yeah, saw a pole. Ah, uh, turn around the corner. Got to be a Bestford. On run taken. Good value for value for shots when you play that in indoor. Tap around the corner. If you can hit it into the ground so it goes up nice and high into the net above where anyone can reach. Well, there's a few clues out there that should help you deduce that we're not playing indoor. Juice. One of, yes, one of which being that they don't have to run very far. On the pitch. Just going to put it out there. If anyone's walking past the camera, it's it's facing, facing at us. <laughs> it's not on you. <gasps> Bouncer. Ah, oh, that's a good pull shot. Oh, slight misfield. Ah, well done. Good shot by Olsen Simpson. You know what I think it is? What do you think it is, Max? I think it is that uh, all the people who walk past and try and avoid the camera, they care. You see it and they're like, oh. I don't want to. Don't want to interrupt. And then there's people who are just like, oh, uh, if you uh, see a camera, they're leaping in front of it, doing a, a dive. Yeah. Short and walloped. One run. Walloped in close for a one. There we go. It's been a while since there's been a clonk. Nothing oh, but was wallops. Just, and there was a few clonks yesterday. There was. I saw them. I might even try and well, come I've, up with a graphic. I felt them. I felt your presence. It's not even Christmas yet. No, I know. 41 off 47 for Joy. Just a few balls to get some oh. maximum scoring going. She gets to fitty. Uh, Pat Mansour says, bets on horses or bets on the lawn bowls next door. Oh. And then he says, uh, rain check at Coolum. It's uh, trying. Uh, trying. Trying. I don't know if there's more to that sentence. Just like Max. Max is trying. My patience, usually. You didn't even know I was a doctor, did you? Are you Dr. Dirty Dan? And I didn't know you were a judge trying them, so this is all very confusing. It all makes oh, sense that's now. It's going to be caught. Taken oh. To the floor. Oh, it's gone. He's taken. dropped him. Oh, it's gone. It's on the floor. And one run taken. That's a lifeline there. That is. I always feel bad. That's what happened to the rain chair, probably. Went to Lifeline. Lifeline gave a spare catch back. That's probably what Yandina did last week. Gave the chair in for a uh, spare catch. Seven for 121. Of course. Of course, it's 121. Now, my uh, 
powers of deductive reasoning aren't the best, but I'm guessing with 25 overs gone of a 30 over match, this innings probably has somewhere between four and six overs left to go in it. Are they going to resort to Kez at some point? Well, I don't know. She seems to be dropping herself down the order. We've got Kylie padded up. And I do see another set of pads on back there with the helmet. Getting acclimatised. Whoosh! That'll be a wide. That's a W from the umpire. That's a woo. I think um, I think the mindset of Kez is that she wants, because she's only filling in every game that we've streamed so far this season for Yandina. And she's she wants them to win. She doesn't want to be a uh, major major part of it. She wants them to win on their own. And I thought not she just wanted to be, to be out there in the last five overs because Kez batting normally is like, boom, bash, whack. And then if someone runs out with the, oh, guy's got up the run rate. Like, wouldn't oh, you wouldn't right want to see that? <laughs> <laughs> be like watching Mel Shelley yeah. yesterday playing the men. Hopefully we'll be able to unwrap that later. Big dive. Oh, four runs. That's just what the Dr. Dirty Dan ordered. Olsen, Sen, 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 with a big four. Look at that. And a dive. And get the order. didn't quite reach it. The knee dug in. Dug like a 1960s hippie tune. I don't know what you're referencing, so I'll just That's leave that out there. For today. That's a no ball. Oh. We got a woohoo. Where's the woohoo? Oh, he just caught the side of that. Yeah, Cabo Bear's just learning English, but he's done very well today. He's tuning in. He's catching most of the uh, commentary. You be nice, okay? I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> oh, wasn't clonkish, but... Uh... That was squirted out a little mm -hmm. bit. Speaking of the cameraman. <laughs> what? <laughs> he, plays, he plays shots like that, that's what I meant. Here we go, Anderson in. Oh. That one. ball going so high, it's like it's jumping over buildings. Oof. I'm going to say 140. It's, it's I'm, I'm not quite sure it's that fast. Maybe 150. 140 to 150 is my possible total, depending on things happening. And the Your possible those. total? Yes. You're getting 140 to 150. Yeah, well, I'm doing the score here. Ooh. Dot. Did I mention dot? Maybe. Dot was mentioned. It's a dot matrix. Pushka. Ah, oh, ball's gone through there. Oh, big arm. Look at that. I almost hear people holding their breath here today. No aliens in the microphone. Bubba G. What's he done? He said the chair never ducked for the cameras. That's true. <laughs> <laughs> Chair was proud. The camera tried ducking out of the way of the chair at it one point. Did yeah. That was the unmanned camera that somehow did that. Speaking Ooh. of chairs, <laughs> one's uh, clapping in the background for the uh, mention of its family. Yes, that's probably what that was. And again. Either that or that's just uh, someone snoring. It's a shotgun. Someone trying to ride in the front seat on the way home by the sound of things. And we've had a change in bowling. I can only tell because the uh, difference from here is uh, 
like a different hair colour. Yeah, I can't see that. Max isn't very good with looking. I'm usually good looking. No! <laughs> Hang on, what are you going to get? <laughs> you got to get something. Joe! <laughs> there we are. Damn you. <laughs> All right, here comes Rex. Sick him, Rex. It's been Wooshka. Oh, and caught. Taken. What a good catch. Taken on the Wooshka. That wasn't right. Joy, was it? No, but Joy's coming. Well, let's see what we can take of that one. Joy. See what we can see. Joy's coming in the form of the incoming bats person. It's been whipped around the corner. Oh, just caught the end of that. Yeah, it's taken. Nice of them being able to just uh, casually go into reverse of what they just did for us. Yeah, it's very handy. And, yeah, well done. Always provide very a stable base. Very happy. You don't want to be catching when you don't have a stable base. That's Olsen, son, 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 son. With a good quick fire innings. How good are the pitches? Well, I haven't been out there today, but they looked pretty good. Well done, Katrina. Well batted. Pretty dry. And a Oh, Pikachuers. Yeah, catch and replays like that. And Katrina Olsen, Colson. Plenty of applause for the outgoing batsman there. Agent Colson. Seven. Providing somewhat of a shield at the end of the innings. Seven off 12. Now, if you look at uh, who the incoming bats person is, business just picked up, ladies and gentlemen. That's Kaz Matthews. They've trundled her out of the cling film, out of retirement. She in a Star Trek movie? Possibly. She was in retirement. They just store her in a stasis cube when they don't need her and then make up lies to make sure that she comes and plays the next week. No, we really need you. I say that to you every week. Yes, and unfortunately, we don't have enough players to not be able to sit you out. It's amazing the kind of people that come out of the woodwork to have to play. We're hearing, we're hearing, uh, better press the buttons, we're hearing some awful C words <laughs> in the background here. <laughs> We don't want to get cancelled. And I don't mean the people that are saying it. No. <laughs> I mean the actual word being said. Yes, you can't say that on YouTube. You'll get cancelled like the rain chair did last week. It didn't get <laughs> just get cancelled. It had people in the van come and take it away. It's got its own channel over on Rumble, apparently. With Crowder and the others. <laughs> All right. We've got a left-hander, a true left-hander at the crease. Yeah, it could be topical and say, so I think Rumble just offered a, a certain podcaster a hell, hell of a... A lot of money to go there. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right, here we go. And back to the cricket, because, you know, why not? Left-hander o'clock. Oh, oh, in the airish again. That's how you play Another yourself great in. great pick-up. They're doing well in the field. Although I would say it's definitely not the best fielder on the coast. We all know who that is. No, self-proclaimed yesterday. He was the, uh, the god of thunder and almighty vengeance yesterday, wasn't he? Certainly was. Tearing rips in the space-time continuum. The fabric of life itself. It was almost, just to take it was almost a uh, DeLorean popped up just to see <laughs> the uh, the events. It was. Marty and, McFly uh, reading from a sports almanac. Yes, and yesterday, my Speaking key. Speaking of which, where is uh, Leah Thompson? What happened to your key? My, my key to catching is to rip it out of the air. It's going to be dot ball. Yeah, that's 48 balls, I believe. It's someone. Is it 50 balls? I think it's 50 ball retirement. 60. 60. Well, she's got a 50 in her then. 
bit more information from the stats person at the back of the booth. Again, this code that I'm just not able to break. <laughs> it's a good ball. Ah, uh, pumped away. That's good. And the it's just the one run there. Just quietly. Others may try for two. There won't be a lot of twos, I don't think, with Kez out there. That's true. Not two. It's funny. It'd be good to have a wide angle of just the field scattering to all corners um, with Kez on strike. With a left-hander. You mean like that? Like that. But not that. Not exactly that. But Might like be that. ready for ball follow. Oh, off the twinkle toes. That's a dot. Wasn't sure what to press then. I haven't pressed that for a while. Is that you? <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, nothing. Oh, Patman wants to know. Wants to know, will the chair be there for the grand final if the grand final's over that way? Unfortunately not. No, chair has been uh, cancelled. Chair was cancelled. It had uh, rabid, uh, rabid uh, Twitter people calling out for it to be cancelled. It was removed. Uh, 8 for 131 off 27 overs. I dare the score table to correct me. That's what I thought. <laughs> Hold on. Nothing. Hold on. Just need to send a camera in that direction. <laughs> uh, apparently Lorraine's been spotted. Out in Africa? Yes. We need the uh, Bureau of Coleology to tell us if it's going to rain shortly or not. We, we have it on good authority. It is not going to rain. <laughs> That's not real rain. If it doesn't draw blood, it's not rain. Right, Kez on strike. And this looks like the opening. Oh, no, there's more? Yep. More to bowl. More to come. And more. And more runs. Now, if this, is, if this is your first time watching Kez bat, uh, sit back. It's going to be enjoyable. <laughs> she did the same thing last week. <laughs> just over the field there. And by just. Field, field all spread back, but, you know. Yes. It's not like he, you know. What I'm, what I'm saying is I don't think she found the middle on that one. It, it, but it's not like um, she, she just popped it straight into the bowler's hand. And that's out that way, bounce, and oh, through. through the fields. And four runs. It's cutting the fine line of do I attack it or do I wait for it? What, what happens? Don't know if I've got time for a replay on that one. I think we need to highlight the package. Uh, we're coming over the wicket. So we're... Oh, giving up? It's, or, oh, it's no. the reverse of giving up. I need to reassess my score. Ah, oh, and it was missed. I hate it when a bird flies out from behind <laughs> yeah. in the forward direction. You're like, whoa, that's, oh, that's, oh, that's, wait, that's changing directions. That's a dog. That ball's got wings on it. It went along the ground and then it zipped up in the air like it's a golf shot. I'm expecting it to be flying around, but you know. There's more. Oh, dainty. Ah. Doing a bunt in close, pretending that she's going to run. Just to draw the field in a little bit. Yes. It's good cricket. Then just to whack it over the head. All right. So we've had a change of bowler. It's more on. I was thinking the uh, batsmen are probably thinking, oh, no, more. That's, that's going to be tough to catch. No, bounce just short. One bounce. One run. It's a 140 up. I have to say, there's uh, quite a decent turnout here at the cricket today. Yes, and it's not all just of the players. Good crowd. Oh, it's catching. Joey's got a second uh, second wind out there. The bat's feeling like a toothpick. Should be 141, I believe. 
28. Two overs to go. Joy needs seven runs to get her 50. From 10 balls. Yes. Kez needs about seven shots to get her 50. <laughs> Man says it's a good turnout mm. up at Coolum as well. It's good. Good support for the finals for the ladies. We like it. Here comes Rex. Oh, wow. Turn That's around. huge. That is huge. That's a massive six. And Joy loves it. I think that might be a first six. She thought she was, she got her retirement on a six, but no, one more run needed. The crowd calls for one more, one more. We can tell by the celebration. Where's, there it goes. And six. Now, did we get celebration back on the other camera? Uh, we, yeah. Unfortunately, not there. But she was stoked. Wow. Well, it's her first ever six, and it was big. It was okay. well big. One run needed. It's funny when you know that you only need one run. <laughs> Everything seems really high level and difficult. I don't know. I remember there was a game where it was like three balls to drinks, and I must have been on 48 or something, 49. And you guys just all yelled out to me exactly what was going on. Yeah. So you blocked it out? No, I didn't. I don't I remember. I got the runs. Uh, well, I got nothing. Yeah, it's well oh, run. Oh, don't run yourself out now. There's the 50 and there we go. 50 to Joy. Everyone's going crazy. If our cameraman can pan to the right, that'd be the right-hand side there for the cameraman panning. If the cameraman panned there. Yeah, maybe, maybe we won't pan. It'll be fine. The whole team there supporting her. Coming in. There we go. Off to meet the mama bear. Might even be forgiven for uh, running around. Yes. <laughs> now we're, we're just going to find out. That may be the first 50 that she scored. Yes, it is. Confirmation. Thanks for that, Statman Jack. First ever sit wherever you are. <laughs> first ever six. First ever 50. And a great partnership with her mum. She better keep well, the pads on. She might need to go out again. Well, we better uh, cut back to the match. Cutting back to the match. Because uh, things going to happen out there now. So I think uh, there's Kez dropping a single. Not sure she knows what she's doing. That puts Kylie on strike. Kylie, the entertainer, she'd like to be known as. Well, <laughs> probably be entertaining then, no matter what happens. She did say she is must-watch television. And for Kylie, this is Freedom Day for her. She's just come out of isolation. Not for anything in general, just because she feels she should be kept away from the public. Ah, oh, all kinds of repeals. And so polite as well. Yes, how is that? Um, if it's all right with excuse, you. Excuse me, <laughs> sir. Is that out? Pardon me, dare I ask, is that out? If you don't mind. 8 for 149 of 29. One over to go. Six balls, possibly. Six legal balls. I reckon my 140 to 150 might come to fruition. And Kez on strike for the uh, 
first ball of the final over. Yes. And it looks to be more on. It is. Wish you wouldn't call me that. All right, and we're uh, set. We're ready. And the it's bowler's more. probably thinking, oh, Kez, or oh, no more. That's been whooshed good around the corner. Get down probably to it. just the one. It will be one. And uh, I'd have to say, if I was bowling, I'd be quite happy with that. It's just the one run, and uh, Kez not on strike. That's 150 up. Kylie Taylor, must-see television. <laughs> Should well, you, speaking of which, if you're out. watching the stream, it's a good idea to put it up on a TV if you, you've got the capacity to do that, because looks great on a TV. Pictures look really good on a full Especially screen. with the volume down. Oh, no! That's boulderized. Pasteurized first, then boulderized. That's a wicket. We might be seeing Joy go back out again very, very soon. Well, she'll be happy with that. She seems to be in form. She's all charged up on cuddles, that's for sure. She's hugged everyone in the team. She's ready to go. It's the aftermath. Wooshka. Leg stump. Let's see it again. There it is. That's a very Taylor shot. That's from Vigoro, that is. Just use the bottom of the part of the bat. A strange sense of deja vu. It's almost like Max is doing that replay thing and playing everything backwards. Joy goes back out to the field. Oh, she should was, run out and quick. do a, a backwards celebration. That'd confuse everyone. I'm already confused. I don't know what you're talking about. Well, that's a constant state of being, I believe. Now, Joy, the most important thing, what I've learnt is, you must stay not out, so... Well, I would say, oh, what, what I thought... Final, you final over, you'd want to block that out, I thought. Well, I was thinking what you were going to say. Best thing to do is to get, get the other person on strike. Uh, the other person is going to be sending some bombs. No, I think Kylie did get a run. She doesn't get a quackmire. Yes, she does. Well, sorry, it's a bit late, but... Well, there we go. That's for you, Kylie. The duck walked off quicker than you did. All right, there's all kinds of fields being set. It's just that feeling, oh, new batsman, they've got to get themselves in. Oh, wait, yeah, they just scored 50. It's like, oh, we just got someone else last over. Nice. At least we've got a... Oh, right, yeah. Well, if we get should, them off strike, we, then it'll be... Yeah. Oh, right. Maybe we shouldn't have got that wicket. <laughs> Someone's appealing. Yes. That must be... Wicket keeper from Coolum, maybe. Maddie. Oh, Wooshka. And reach, you mean? punching the single, punching. getting Kez on strike. That was shot from punch bowl. Yeah, I'm happy with that. Here we go. Well. That's big. It's going to take some and catching. And caught. That's well caught. Very well caught. But the celebrations on the catching. Or just go back to the middle where we already have a shot. Well, uh, that's the end of the innings. It's wicked, and they've got to be... Make it. I think uh, Karui Yamundi would be very happy with that. Let's yes. take a look at that final one there. Did look like it was going to become a bit of a, uh, a chase. Gone for the big hit. It was a clean hit. Little, little uppish. And, and straight in. Catch. And the big celebration. Yes, he caught it. That's another 20 runs we don't have to score. That's well done. So... In the end, 152 runs required for victory by Karoya Mundi. Going to be a lot, a lot of runs to chase down. I think they would definitely be happy they've managed to get them all out. Joy being not out at the end, that's, uh, I think, well-deserved there. 
And good cricket from Yandina. So and they're Karoy gonna, Mundi. They're going to need a run rate of five. Not easy to get. Well, now, speaking of which, there's the, the chair's not there. There's no rain chair, but uh, there is rain. There's a rain chair in there. Covers are going out. We've got covers patrol. So in this rain break, we just saw uh, some big hitting towards the end of the innings there. I've got some more big sh big hitting I can share with you. We, we uh, What's we the chances if, uh, if I send you off for a minute, you reckon you could go and get Joy to sit with us? Maybe. Maybe I could. Because I can't get out with you sitting there. Really? Yeah. There we go, I move. <laughs> well done. Good stuff. Max is just going for a quick run. Oh, go and do some producing. He's going to do some hum human producing. I could have worded that better. <laughs> All right. Max will be back shortly with a not surprised guest. So the rain, uh, it's not heavy rain. It's not pelting the women and children. Pelting the women and children like a U2 song from Joshua Tree. So hopefully we can have the covers on and the rain will be purely for the duration of the innings break. That'll be just perfect, I reckon. Good timing. Max is off uh, not doing what he said he was going to do. He's just having a good old chin wag by the look of things. Right, so we're uh, we're looking to see if there's going to be any any upper deets. No upper deets. Uh, the total at Coulomb, nine for 141. Ooh. High scoring day. Yes. I uh, don't know if there's any rain up there, but it's just started raining here. And um, as I was going to say before, that uh, there was some, uh, some big hitting towards the end of that innings. And uh, yesterday at Palmwoods, we, we, we talked to you quite a lot about... Uh, Mel Shelley and her husband. Is she joining us? Having a comp not yet. Okay. We'll, we'll talk to her later. I hope. Uh, they have a competition to see who can score the most, who can hit the most sixes, and whatnot. She's just walking past us now. I was just about to tell everyone about yesterday. They were uh, playing as, as uh, as Max likes to say, River Wemmer and Stanley. Uh, they, they five for three hundred thirty-one. They got. Palmer's 155. The two scores I've got circled here, Dan Shelley, 21 runs off 21 balls, 5-4, so that's 20 runs in boundaries. Then uh, down here we've got Mel, 42 not out off 15 balls, 6 fours, do the totals, that's 24. Three sixes, that's 18. 24 and 18 equals, that's right, 42. Zero runs, <laughs> all boundaries. Uh, that's a destroyer. That's a destroyer that's, of worlds. That's a innings, proper that left-handed innings. <laughs> I bet the uh, the gentlemen at Whamuran were um, handing the ball to other people, going, "No, nah, I'm not bowling." <laughs> and, uh, yeah, and they they go, "Oh well, uh, thank God we don't play women's cricket." <laughs> yeah, absolutely. <laughs> Hopefully, uh, the final. And then, and then Mel goes, "Oh." We only won a game or two this season. Yeah. <laughs> Couldn't get enough runs. <laughs> Hopefully, though, wow. Mel, uh, Mel will be able to join us for the final. Do some commentary. If we can get it before she decides to leave. She's, uh, she's, seen, she's seen her chance. The rain's coming down. She's gone, right, I'm out of here. Ah, well, cool. I'm uh, 9 for 141 at the close up there. No, no rain up there. Oh no! Oh, and the, the aliens, the aliens here. have just joined us. We're getting uh, conflicting, 
conflicting uh, scores for the other page. And the most unreliable source seems to be Volder Corley. Yes. Uh, Bubba G said, hashtag maths of not Lano's... Maths, maths not Lano's strength. I can't see how that works. I think it's just I had a math fine. teacher in high school. He actually got, ended up being fired. He said he didn't understand why. He always go 110%. No, that doesn't get that anything. Joke. Nope, that, sir, is a that joke. <laughs> now, Bubba, I don't know what we're talking about. Math's not been my strength. I can work out which bowlers need to go where, when, and if not, dig a clown out of my pocket to bowl the final over if need be. No, I think he mispronounced Seth. Nope, Miss clown. Misspelt. Clown. I could tell them your figures if you like. Me? For that last over you bowled. Wasn't I don't even know what that was. It wasn't 19. It was oh. double figures, however. Was it 12? <laughs> yeah, it was about 11. All oh, right. That's pretty good for me. You well, did. were they not batsmen? You did end the innings. I'll give you that. Right, so who, who's out there? Bubba looks like he's bored. Well, that's uh, just what we want from uh, the... People in our streams the tuning board. in, tuning the in. Like, oh, board. I'm bored now. Well, he's here. Is he? He must be bored. He's in the chat. Oh, don't confuse me like that. Now the rain's just coming down. It's hard. It's hard to tell without uh, without a chair, without a rain chair to go up against. But we do our best. Hopefully, we'll have maybe. Uh, when I say maybe, maybe in the next two seasons, we'll have a. Uh, a rain screen that we can put up. Speaking of seasons. Yes, four seasons. Yes, there is, well, there's five, isn't there? There's summer, winter, autumn, spring and fall. No, no, no. No, in Queensland there's two seasons. Summer and not summer. Which, which is the, the hot one? Uh, well, not summer lasts for about three weeks. Sometimes. Okay. If it goes for a while. Usually in February. <laughs> yes. Well, we get summer rain. We get winter, not summer rain. All right. Well, this is uh, this gives Karoy a chance to, to game plan and to say, right, how are we going to do this? Okay. Right. You eat lots of bananas. Uh, you drink all of the energy drinks. Um, just coming back to some of the information there that's coming through on the chat so apparently it says lano did you just use a calculator to work out the run rate required of course i did i wanted it to be exact hashtag maths not lano's strength i want surely it. using a calculator means you understand something about maths well you can turn yeah you know, what's this button what's this button for eight double oh eight if i get three and Seven, then I get three, 10. Five, five. 3 plus 10 equals 30. Because that, that's the plus button, isn't it? I don't know. I only count in fours and sixes. That's how I roll. You use the fours? Mm, I do. Yep. Well, thanks for tuning in. <laughs> it's been you're, a great you're, here, you're here for all of the <laughs> wonderful insights that we have. Yes. If only we had some kind of. Rain delay filler set up. Yeah, speaking of which, uh, what we do have, if I uh, scroll through here somewhere. Here we go. Uh, coming up, we have some finals. So, well, don't worry about the second division one day final. That's been and gone, and we didn't stream it because it was raining. And, uh, but after that, so let's, let's do this smartly, hey? Let's start. This is going to be horrible because I won't be able to see what it says. Let's get rid of the scores. Again, wonderful insight. So next week we have the semi-final winners from today's match here and the winners of the match over where Thunder Corley is uh, situated. So those, they will be playing next week and we'll be streaming that match and following that will be the Stage 3A Grand Finals the following Sunday. And then the following week, we've got nothing, nothing on. But after that, the three-day 
grand final of the first divisions where Tawantan Noosa will finally be defeated. We're just not sure by who yet. So, <laughs> oh, it's all happening here. Alrighty. And uh, yeah, things going on in the background. So, as I was saying, the stage three, no, not the stage three, the Division One Grand Final, three days, we'll be introducing some new fun things that we might be able to be doing through the off season if you're interested in here. What are you talking about? I'm just wondering where that sentence was going. It was like a headless chicken. <laughs> and? Well, I suppose you get two drumsticks. Well, if I just sit here and say nothing like you, <laughs> we would improve the intelligence in this stream. That's what would happen. Oh. The aliens have joined us. They've come to let us know that they're not enjoying the stream. <laughs> that needs a little bit of extra. I don't Spice. speak that language. No. That's backward talk. It's smack. Aliens are talking smack. Great movie called uh, Top Secret, where they literally film a scene, at the whole scene backwards. Hmm. Yep. It's with the late, great uh, Sir Peter Cushing. Mm -hmm. And he also happened, for that particular scene, wow. had a cast of his head made. Right. Incredible. And that was what was used for Star Wars Rogue One to map the digital face of him. Yeah, yeah I'm yes. full of all was of the information. Was it a cast of thousands? And <laughs> they may have got the wrong one because he has uh, some face deformities in, uh, some weird looking in stuff. Top Secret. But it's worth, worth worth a good watch. I thought they might have used it for Snoke. <laughs> it wasn't business. that deformed. <laughs> well, there's a there's a, a tunnel we don't want to enter into. That's for sure. Yes, we'll start talking about all of the. Uh, yeah, let's just stay right away from that. They never happened. I don't know what you're talking about. Right. Yep. Good. We're live. Just uh, make sure we don't get any spicy alien talk. Looks like they're out checking the covers. Wow, that silence is absolute. Oh, it's just when we turn off the uh, <laughs> surround microphone. Ah, look at that. Sun is shining. Weather is clear. There we go. What's the weather like where you are, Bubba? Where even are you? Are you still on the coast? Have you returned to your abode? The uh, cover's starting to come off. They are, are they, there we go. Billowing like a great sail. Not a bake sail. Or a brake sail. I've seen that happen where they forgot to take the pegs from the bottom end and they rush it out and they go whoosh, whoosh, whoosh. Ah, whack. Ah. Oh, thanks. All my fingers are gone. Yep, gone ski. Well, there hasn't been a lot of strong wind today, luckily. Yesterday was very breezy. Yes. Here we go. Look at that. It's going up like a huge Pakistani mocky. So you take that off towards the member's end. Sounding like a uh, headless chicken there, Leno. No. I wouldn't even make the team. Well, I would like to know how uh, how and what the conversations going on in the Kuroya Mundi dressing room would be. Whether they're thinking how they... I don't they think you're allowed in there, Max. I'm, I'm not going to go in there. I'm just thinking, what's their approach listen, going to be? Here. We're sitting out the front of us. <laughs> they said, wish those idiots something about rubbish and streaming. That's all I've got. Righto. Crossing now back <laughs> to the end of my sentence. Wondering how they're going... That's a start. They're, they're, how they're going to approach their run rate here or their, their, their run chase. Well, I'd say fiverly is how they need to do it. World of insight you are today. I'm here to help. Yeah. It's 
what I'm all about. Beautiful day for it. Driving the country with a wife and kids, top down. We had also heard that there's going to be someone quarantining on the far side of the field. If you've got a convertible, you could do that as well. Uh, yeah, we haven't seen anyone, have we? No, I only thought about it because there's a car just mm, casu- I've been watching. casually... I've been watching and then wondering if um, possibly it's not the best to highlight them if they were here and not where they should be, even if they were in a car. They could be doing essential things like watching their team play cricket. That could be classed as being essential, surely. Looks like everyone's having their own rain break in the chat. Let's play who in the chat that knows how to type uh, is the furthest away from us here at Yandina. Put your votes in, where are you? Let's hear from you. So far today we've had a a roll call of one, two, three, four, five, six. Six different people checking in today. Uh, maths, not Lano's strong point. Yeah, it's like that's been there for ages. I was more referring to uh, to the fact that you, you know, taking so long to count through. Well, when you've got to scroll through the whole chat to get all the different names, that's how that works. A likely story. You wouldn't know. You don't do the heavy lifting around here. Looks Sorry like about that. I was just doing some producing. So we've got Koo Roy. They're padded up. They're keen. They're going to go do some uh, some throwdowns. Maybe a couple of glasses. I don't know that that's a safe place for uh, yes <laughs> for the porcelain one to be. If the wall goes through. There's, there's certain danger. In some <laughs> cases, there's no such thing as a safe space. That's true. Well, technically, it's normally, what, a 20-minute break between innings? We've got to be getting close to that. So maybe we did get the perfect time for the rain was in the innings break. And we don't lose too much. Yeah. Umpire's now wandering outside. Thought they might have been wandering out loud. And they were going to go on next. All right, so if the order is correct that was given to us by the Cougars... I say that because that's their team name. Brian Monday Cougars. We've got Fiona Gardner and Donna Moore going to be opening the batting. But as they like to do sometimes, they change that. Just so that we say the wrong people and look silly. Well, we look silly. We don't need any assistance. No, we can do that on our own. Well, umpires now making their way back out to the field. Can't see there because that's uh, cameras pointing into so the danger area. Things I can tell you, Fiona, Fiona Gardner, state softball player when 15, didn't pick up a bat again until 13 years ago. Second oldest in the team. I won't say the age. And we spoke about uh, Donna Moore from Harvey Bay, only grandma in the team, rep, represented Victoria in AFL and cricket. There we go. Here we go. Probably some, uh, plenty of bat- batting expertise there. Well, some good contact happening out in front of us with the uh, throwdowns. Yeah, Yandina, they'll be down there discussing bowling tactics. Well, the umpires are standing out in the middle going, what's going on? He's, oh, he's <laughs> just called for a <laughs> replay. for a replay. You got a replay of, the, of his replay? What Speaking of replays, what have we got? we've got... Not that. That's the end of the game. 
And not that. Probably you went. Rec Here we go. Here we go. No, uh, we didn't get it, did we? Because you weren't recording it. I uh, will see that last. That last catch again. Yes, and the celebration. Trying to make it seem like that's what you're trying to do the whole time. Great celebrations. That's how it's done. Here we are. Running from miles away. So, umpires called the replay. There ah, we go. Nick D's joined us. Great rain delay commentary with some exasperated emojis. Well, Nick, we can't all be dazzling slash bangers like yourself turning up to make every situation you're in better. Oh, and uh, just a reminder to anyone listening out there, if you think you can do a better job of commentary, do not send us an email. And uh, Max at Telestream. No, we don't, we, don't, we don't want to hear that you could turn up and do a better job. At Max. We at would prefer you to show us. TV. <laughs> Enjoy out there. Yeah. Because the last thing that we need is quality commentary. It would ruin what we have going on. Exactly. Here. It's our niche market. Max at Telestream.tv. Yeah. And just remember, there's a three day final coming up as well. And uh, we will be talking for three full days of cricket unless. Well, even if anyone says, sends us that uh, sort of email saying, oh, I, I reckon I could do that for 10 minutes or so. I think we'll show you guys up, maybe get up a lunch break, think about something other than having a focus on the game. And well, I'd just have a little nap, maybe. Go and have a sleep under a car. I somewhere. don't remember what that is. <laughs> well, schools should be ready to go back up. Oh, there we go. Scores up. It's like you're doing all the work here, Lano. Heavy lifting. That's me. So, it looks like I'll just sift through all the answers to my question to involve the chat. And uh, there was... Oh, early wicket uh, for Coolum up there at Coolum. That's by... Peter Voldecorley, we don't mention his name. Ah, uh, they're doing well out in the field there. You stand in a group and point and uh, and gesture. No, I think um, they're doing the hokey pokey. That's, well, I haven't seen a right foot. I've seen a left arm in and a left arm out. Look, waiting Someone's for a shake gonna it shake all about. It. Maybe the bowler. Well, she turned around. And that's she what it's did, all about, apparently. Ready for play. Scorers are ready. Umpires are ready. Bowlers ready. Number seven, bowler. Yes, that was our left-handed uh, batter. So Laurie on strike. This is Donna. On strike. Almost like you can't hear things that are being said by other people when you've got these headphones on. As we said, Fiona and Donna. That's Donna on strike, Donna Moore. And Alyssi chasing that one down. No runs, now she's got one. For the first. One more. First runs of the Kuroyu Monday innings. That's one more. More one. That's Kay Scott. Scott is bowling. Great Scott. I know, this is heavy. Mm. Left arm That's with a no ball. No ball. <laughs> that should be the first woohoo of the innings. But we won't there do anything it is. about that. We'll just stay sensible. It's been a good holiday to Europe. Did... Uh, Bushka. That's a dot. Did, Mel, did Mel Shelley disappear? Went home. Oh. I was. You probably missed that when it happened right in front of you. I don't know what you're talking about. Uh, you might have been on a holiday with the cameraman. Not with the cameraman, but 
the same time. Oh, oh, that's... Oh. That's oh, close. Close. I was like, that's going for four, but uh, no. Nope. Nope. Very lucky there. And a dot. Dottage. Dottery armor armorage. Oh, trying to be cheeky there. So I'm just I wanting why. to confirm. What would you like to confirm? Is it whoever wins this game hosts the next match? Yeah. Or? It all depends. Because the next game's the final. It depends on what grounds are available. Yeah. So I think the association will decide. But if they have a home ground available, then I think maybe it would be... Basically, if if you and Dina win because they're top of the table, then they they you would think they would be the ones with the choice. Yes, I would think so. Doesn't always but I, go but I was wondering wants. if Karui Yamundi um, pull off this run chase, if because they were fourth, if it actually goes to it would someone depend. higher, it would depend on who wins the other game and both of whom would be higher. So that's where it's a who knows basket. Right. Put in the who the heck knows that? I'm assuming someone at the association. Well, someone. I wouldn't assume too deeply. You'd hope. Sometimes it's better to hope than to assume. Mel Shelley says she's heading to Coolum. Heading to Coolum. I hope you're in a horse drawn carriage or something while no, you're typing no, that. No, no, no. She's riding a horse. <laughs> <laughs> Missed that before when we're talking about the horse riding. Just uh, make sure you stay on there. Yep. And the start of the second over. Well. It's played around the corner for one. And uh, again, I think my ears are deceiving me. I have a feeling that Kerry O'Keefe is not at the ground. <laughs> <laughs> no, it is. Well, this is the uh, the first bowl that she's bowled since, the, since December. Uh. It's uh, Holston, happy traveller from South Brisbane. Oh, that's being given as a W. I don't want to say it, but it looks like she hasn't bowled since before Christmas. <laughs> oh, wait a second. There's a throwing, a throwing someone under the bus there. Someone has to do it. <laughs> I think I'm the person for that uh, job. Turned around and hold well on. Very good arm coming back in there. The bounce throw. Probably not the best idea with a wet outfield. <laughs> feel like we're looking out of a thin caravan window here watching. Good bit of fielding. Oh, nice camera work there too. Got to applaud when they are awake. Nope, we've called some kind of something. Nope, just a dead ball. I wonder if they're playing. Well, they've been bowling really well, Peter Sleep. <laughs> Cross live back to the end of my sense at some point. That's a dot. I wonder if they're playing the super sub rule where you can name 12, one of them doesn't bowl, one of them doesn't bat. Because we didn't see Kerry. Bat, I didn't think, did we? Unless she know. opened and wasn't out there very long. Oh, that didn't bounce very high. The uh, way to answer that question is if she has a uh, number three or a number four on her back. Fourteen, I believe, is what she's got on her back. Well, she's got a four on her back then. Didn't help anyone. Great fielding. Oh, Lissy. Throwing for a run out. You'd think, given the way that she feels, she would understand that there's people that could run her out if she ran when she's not going to be in. But she doesn't mind. She just runs and runs and runs and runs and runs. Yeah. Well, sometimes it pays to put pressure on your field. It's done for seven off two. If Bubba can help me in the uh, chat to tell me what that run rate is, because I can't work that out. Aaron Greaves, Mel's inning was even better live. So what she's saying is it's better to be here than to actually watch us. Thanks for the uh, support. 
That's nice. Too and right. now they're laughing at us. <laughs> I bet it would have been live and enjoyable. I'm thinking there may be some sort of super sub rule. Just, just because uh, Jackie Sparkles is right there in front of us. Wow, it's almost like I've been through that entire thought process myself, made the statement just for you to have it state back to me. <laughs> I get the feeling you're trying to say something. Well, I'm not sure what it is. Well, when you learned a word, you can get back to me. Dot. The trick is to say it more leadingly, like, I think there's probably a super sub rule in play. Ah, oh, stop repeating yourself. <laughs> Where uh, they're able to name 12 and one of them doesn't bat but can bowl, he says leadingly. That's what I think. Um, we've got confirmation from the officials on that one. I was, in fact, correct. Sorry, I've got this really <laughs> weird Xbox controller here. Did you want to have a go? <laughs> Nope. <laughs> I'll watch the replay to Thanks. see Thanks. I'll just sit there and go, oh, they ran one. What do I do? Oh, uh, one. <laughs> <laughs> That's beyond him. That's wide. Do you know what to do with that, Max? Uh, well, yeah. <laughs> Take that as a no, then. I'll swap you someday. You can do the switching. Record the replays. It'll be play amazing. Play the replays. Throw an ad in here when you remember something funny that you can't say on air. In the last over, there hasn't been one replay, one ad. You've been doing nothing. That's what you've nothing, been doing. Nothing, hey? Other than confusingly switching and trying to drive a bus over me while I'm talking to people. That's all. See, I can drive a visual bus. Because I know exactly how your devious mind works. I'm a visual person. Visual learner, I believe that is. We're getting ball by ball um, uh, live score updates on the scoreboard. <laughs> Being that we've got Karoy playing, they'd be used to that. Bowler here is doing very well. Interesting action. Uh, left foot followed by the right foot, followed by the left foot, and the right foot, and the left foot, and the right foot. Sometimes, Max, you know, <laughs> you really are <laughs> ahead. Yes, I uh, believe I've heard that numerous times. Wushka. Oh, that's a whitey. And over. Don't get that very often. Yes, that's always odd. No, I'm just going to leave that there and go with that. None for 12 off three. Yet again, Bubba, if you're in the chat, let us know what the run rate is. <laughs> um, Mel's innings, but now I'm watching you. Uh, but I'm watching you now, so that counts. As long as I don't try and backtrack. That. You're as bad as Lano saying at the end of the day, I think you had a good sentence in there, Max. At some point in the uh, four-hour stream? No, normally I'm referring to one sentence that sounded like three conversations happening at once. That's a dot. There. And uh, let's see a replay of that. <laughs> there you go. Glad you're here, Max. Wooshka. Bet he didn't record that. <laughs> That's one. Want to go for a replay? We don't need you flexing. <laughs> oh, it's been well played. Employed the foot of destiny to stop that one. Well, I don't know, Mel, you could have stayed to explain the rules, but the second we offered a headset to you, you ran like a scalded cat. Must have been all those singles you took yesterday. Wait a second. That's why she's still able to run. Exactly. And uh, even though Max is very rude, uh, thanks for joining us, Lauren. Yeah. Why am I rude? Only rude to you. you it's only because you deserve it. You hand out jip like it's some kind of gypsum mine. Well, Lauren I'm tells a, us all sorts I'm of interesting facts. She's been on the kitchen sink telling us about uh, young uh, young uh, Miss Aleph. 
getting all the wickets. Wooshka! That'll be another one. Well, if they keep just scoring oh. a run ball. Must be some issue with the field over that side because there's been a few missed fields over there. Just some uneven bounce. I believe we may have used that section of the uh, the ground for a pitch last year at one, one point. You know what's not good? It's when you're getting sledged by the scorer who's sitting two and a half metres away. <laughs> See, I have this trick where I don't listen. Yes, that's what I thought. Yeah, really, if we boiled it down, they'd realise that we threw it to them a long time ago and they didn't confirm, so they weren't listening. Full toss. That's not a nice way to talk about the scorers. Wow. Ouch, that was an easy. That's a dot. Oh, the fight and talk's coming out. Oh, I think she's talking to us. Well, we're not going to attack anything. As a rock back Maybe each other. on that one. I think the uh, the batsman heard the attack attack and thought it was uh, no, you mean information me. for them. All right. Sure, I'll go with that. <laughs> oh, being very watchful. I think that may have been an appeal in that. Is, uh, I think it's Either Kelly, that or Kelly's the person in the car right in the middle of the pitch. I, never mind. Uh, we won't be mentioning that because we don't want to get anyone in trouble. We've been wondering if they were going to turn up and whether we should uh, bring attention to whether they're there and whether they're allowed to be there. We're just not sure if anyone that should be somewhere else should be somewhere else. <laughs> Would this be? Well, I may. Would this be considered essential? I'm going <laughs> to cut uh, to a commercial at the end of this over. <laughs> We're having a good one-sided conversation. All right, we're ready and close with the crocodile. Wish ya. That's good. Bit of pop in that. Bit of vim and vigor. And that's the end of the over. From what I can see, the score is none for 17. So the kind of ads we've got available are 15 second ads like this one or 30 second ads, which really, if I was making it, would feel like some kind of teledrama. Probably look like it too. Well, let's, uh, we are back live now, so let's uh, <laughs> not continue that conversation. <laughs> We could drive buses all day. I would say cricket is the kind of game, though, where if any... I reckon if you were needing to isolate, you could probably do it out on the field chasing the ball around. <laughs> you could do. Or batting. It's not like you're within a metre and a half of anyone else. Well, you could do a batting and just don't go and talk to the other person in the middle of the pitch. Mm. You don't have to be isolating for that. It's one of the good things about cricket, though, is that you've got so much space that, like, say if you were a family or something, as long as you did things the right way, you'd be able to uh, all enjoy cricket yourselves. Like, I mean, hypothetically, imagine if there was a family in that car over in the background in the distance. If you all just were in that car... With the air conditioning on, watching, that'd be fine. I think we've we've been. Call, I think call for a replay on that. No, I think for uh, the dignity of people, we're not going to do that. <laughs> they want to see it. The well, team, the I, I may have I may have thought at some point that that nothing more was happening, so I stopped recording. So what you're saying is you're stuffed up. It's a very nice day today out there. Very bright. Hmm. Doesn't describe the commentary booth at all. I think that's all done. Should I? Anything else going to happen here? Maybe keep it going. Let's keep it going all the way. 
Well, I only have a certain amount of memory, as you've noticed. <laughs> yeah, we're talking megabytes and double digits. <laughs> They're wide on that. Megabytes? Yeah. I think thinking kilobytes. <laughs> All right. I thought the umpire might have called a wide on that, but he didn't. Arms might be a bit, a bit flappy sore. Ooh, delicate. Andina not so loud in the field at the moment. Probably feeling the pressure. No yes. wickets yet, and yeah, 20 runs on the board. And probably need a bit of a rev up from off field from their supporters although if you're looking and teammates. At, although if you're looking at the scoring uh, from where we are, it's 520. Mm. So he's still got the same bowling. No, we've got a change. Change up in the bowling. Looks That's like Joy Bessford. Joy, she'd be tired, you'd think. Ah, oh, she would, she'd have a bit of a spree in her step, though. You like that uh, person we played against the other week that uh, was called for a no ball. <laughs> I had, had some spring in this step after that. She does seem to have a performance enhancing headband on. We might have to. Yeah, close she up must of have that. been wearing that when she was batting. You'd think so. We've got a close up of the performance enhancing headband, uh. he says leadingly. At some point in this game when it's convenient. Go like now would be good. That's a dot. We could just not do that at all. Yeah. Wait, you expect me to move a camera, do you? Not you. You're the one who's doing heavy lifting, mate. I do all the heavy lifting. It's the uh, it's my key to success. Is that performance enhancing headband that may or may not exist? You're being too obvious. What I think you, you need to do is say something along the lines of, is that bowler wearing a performance-enhancing headband? Imagine if we got a close-up on that at some point that was convenient. Oh, bowling like that might be performance-enhanced. There is the performance-enhancing headband. Look at it. Look at the enhancement. That's fantastic. Both umpires are very jealous. She doesn't look like she spent half the day out there batting already. She looks fresh as a daisy. That ain't right. Well, uh, if you remember what it's like to score 50s, that can be quite refreshing. It's been a while. I didn't know they built a bus stop into this new uh, shed. <laughs> oh, there'll be plenty coming on a Sunday. You worry. Oh, that's been given. Oh, no. No one else on the field appealed. <laughs> well, it appears the performance enhancing headband may actually be some kind of neural transmitter. It's a talisman. For the umpires. It's come through. Have we got a replay on that? Because, um, uh, well, it's a very nice day out there. <laughs> heavy lifting there. Uh, anyone got a replay on that? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Tonight I'm going to to enjoy a tasty meal of off their menu. We'll see you all there after the game. Contact us to make this for you. Is that good enough? And we're back. Oh, uh, I think you might have missed the might, replay. Might have missed the replay on that one. I don't think it was caught behind. I think the ball was coming down. Well, I think that's just called gravity. That's a wicket, wicket, McSpigot. Oh. What do we got in the chat? Valdecoli. Valdecoli with uh, three for 19 off seven up at Coolum. Is it wrong that I'm just thinking of cauliflower when you say that? 
cauliflower. <laughs> Spectators throwing some uh, people <laughs> under chase. the bus. All right, we got. It's going down in the big smoke. Wide called. from that over not much at all one for 70 one for 21 off eight overs one for 71 yeah it's oh, not what i said that i didn't say that at all one for 21 i well, said well i've got a replay on oh, no. it you've got a replay nothing no, i'm replaying his poor uh, commentary he's got nothing Joey Besford coming back in. Wooshka. Probably would have been a run there. Might I'm sure Alyssi would have gone for it. She'd have taken three. Apologies for the noises in the background. Some of these people can't uh, <laughs> control themselves. <laughs> Cut shot, well fielded. And plenty of calls for replays. Well played. Well, I'm, uh, I can admit I'm not very good at maths, but this uh, tight bowling at the moment from Yandina is not going to be helping uh, Karoy Yamandi's run rate. Okay, thank you, Captain Obvious. We'll next be joined by Let's Say Something That Everyone Can Tee. Can what? Can tee? Tee. Tee it up. Here we go. So you want me to say something obvious? No, you've got that covered, usually. Right, I think I'm watching the replay of replays right now. It's like two people appealed. It's a dot. to get out of that one. Ball and slow ball bounces. Don't have a lot of intent at the moment for the running between the wickets. Is that obvious enough for you, Lena? Uh, it's pretty obvious that you don't know what you're talking about. Right, I'm going to watch that LBW myself in slow motion. By the end of the next over, we'll be good to go. One for 21 off nine. Well. Gets you all the insight, doesn't it? From looking at that replay Ooh. of the, uh, the LBW, height is fine. We can't see line. Because you didn't put one on your shoe like I did. That's not wrong. 
Anyone that's wanting to watch the replay themselves, uh, you can go to some time in the timeline that I can't tell you because it's not showing me. There's another appeal there. That definitely didn't have any issue for height. Speaking of height, uh, when we arrived here this morning, there was a gentleman over on the uh, far field that... Uh, <laughs> I'm not sure I can finish that sentence. It's not because I forgot. <laughs> it was, I think he had a board game, Rock'em Sock'em Robots, I think it was. He was definitely a fan of uh, Tony Stark. Maybe there's like a, a superhero that we don't know of no, called, called, no, there called Sock there, Man. There isn't. Let's start with C. There yeah. definitely is not. <laughs> Any spell sock? C? No. Is that an advert we were going to? <laughs> <laughs> no, no advert. Back to the performance enhancing headband of Joy Bestford. There we go. Getting it to bounce off the pitch quite well. Get a little a edgish there. Edgy bra. Oh, no, he's a friend of mine, edgish. Oh. Just over there, a little edgish. I wondered. If you listen carefully, you'll hear the tumbleweeds. <laughs> How is Nick Donahue, I wonder? No, you only get one in an innings. The other ones have to be out. Apparently, that's what they're telling me. That's what Karoy are telling me. <laughs> Sean Nicholl says, lucky I didn't start at the movie references. You're on top of things. You know that that, uh, that chat goes downwards, right? Not upwards. I'm at the bottom of it. Well, there's a comment in there by Volder Corley that... Yeah, I saw that one... I was just going through the ones before that. I believe that that's invalid. Well, I don't even know where valid is. Well, How am I supposed to know what's invalid? Well, it's just outside the suburb of relevant. Wide called. It's wild ball. Wide ball. Ah, talking heads. Once in a lifetime, you'll see them come into a... Oh, don't get started, meow. <laughs> oh, take it. Yeah, it's oh. good cricket. Now, I'm not sure I've got that on the replay. I doubt you've got anything but on the replay. I think that may have been out. Wicket, wicket, McReplay. Or not. Apparently, we're not doing replays today. If you want to talk to us, come and put a headset on. <laughs> that's, uh, that's a zero replay for that one. Negative, Ghost Rider. Uh, Request denied. <laughs> yeah. Well, out of a team of three, two of us are pulling our weight. And one of us keeps forgetting to record things for the replay. <laughs> Just a note, if anyone's wondering. Well, I think, I think there seems to be an issue with uh, Mr. Lanham's microphone. I'm not sure he'll be joining us again for the rest of the stream. <laughs> Yes, there's a <laughs> bit of a problem there. We'll just yeah. uh, fix that for you. Yes. Uh, oh, oh, sorry, we cut. I, I don't get muted. Uh, sorry, it was on us for a second. Just uh, got to do some producing. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're a real professional. 
It's not how you kiss. That's a dot. So anyway, in uh, what you would have seen in that replay that didn't happen was uh, some very good indoor cricket skills. Bounce throw in and a good positioning of the bowler right near the stumps to grab it and take the bales off. And caught and bowled. That's a very nice day. <laughs> Dare we ask if there's a replay of that? Oh, wait, we might have a replay. And on the closer up version. And on the closer up version. Yeah. There we go. And then that was there. And then that got hit. And then that came back the other way. And then taken. There we go. Good low down catch. That's the low down. <laughs> Our producer has told that's us uh, that everything's all right. Let's look at that again just because it's. Uh, on. Let's go to real time. Let's we'll go double speed. Just why not? You know, anything else you guys want? Just for you to do <laughs> the one thing right the one time when it's needed. <laughs> Righty, oh, I'll do one thing right when it's needed, you f <laughs> <laughs> Just the one. Not asking for too much. I have got the right button there. <laughs> yeah. yeah, you don't want to be an absolute <laughs> wet. <laughs> you don't know what you're talking about. Oh, no. <laughs> this is yours. How do you... No, that goes forever. All right, stop it. All right, here we go. It's three for 23. More moon balls coming in. That can be dangerous. That's a dot. Dot it is, was, is. Do you want a replay of that one as well? No, nah, we'll be good, thanks. Yeah, well, shut up. Just the important ones. There we go. Oh, they're going to take it. They're cheeky. Taking a cheeky run, and that's out too. Yes! Dare I ask? Dare I ask? Now, we've got our producer here making sure that we're doing it all right. Here we go. In the meantime, they're doing a bit of, yeah, let's go. And then... And the pick up and comes in. And that stuff happened that you missed there. What? <laughs> Nothing. Nothing happened. Those stumps aren't fixing themselves, are they? A little bit of scoreboard pressure, I think. People trying to get extra mm. runs. Maybe forcing it when they shouldn't be. Well, the, it's one of those things. When there's a slight misfield like that, it's difficult to tell. And uh, got yeah. an update from Fred McKee up at Coolum. Caloundra are three for 33 off 12. I did say no. Not sure who the new batsman in is. You batter, uh, batter Rama. New batter in. Ah, Miss Anderson. Well, if I wanted to get really technical, I'd throw out names like Bugs, but no one's seen that movie yet. <laughs> that movie lives in our equipment. Every time we stream, I'm pretty sure. I think that's where they ruined the sequels because, you know, you can't just casually throw Niobe into a sentence. No. Good ball. Well taken. Good appeal. All round. Well done. Well done by the batter. Not to touch it. Get 
Get some good revs on that. Coming down. Well, you know, some of us are lead foots. Should be the end of the over. Four for 23 off 12. So that uh, that last over, that was Louise Hayko bowling. Where's her family? Are you up? Are you watching over there in the yuck? Uh, I believe it's pronounced ook. Ah, oh, right. My mistake. Yuki. When I was in, when I was in school, <laughs> there was legitimately in the geography. Did you going to say when you were in hospital? No, when I was in school, <laughs> there was legitimately something in, in my geography class and we were talking about the UN and they kept on calling it the UN. <laughs> it's an honest mistake. It's just a bit unlucky. I used to think the Bougainville rebels that were all over the news used to drive around in cars and make trouble for themselves. Turned out that wasn't the case. Oh, oh good, good contact on that. Turned around the corner. Fielders are in place for it though. One taken. I um, wasn't entirely aware that the super sub rule meant that you didn't have to field at all. Well, if you make yourself an essential worker by updating the score ball by ball, apparently, you don't have to go out and field. Oh, well, someone's doing the heavy lifting. Probably doing Facebook updates as well by the look of things. Got a, got a team chat going and it's like, oh, this ball, this what? happened. <laughs> Why is no one responding to the team chat? Oh, that's right, they're all out fielding. That's where I should be. <laughs> I'll, I'll get that bus. Oh. There we go. <laughs> it's another bus. Only through needs here. about 50 <laughs> more there. <laughs> All right, Kelly Scott. Ooh. Ooh. Couldn't get bad on that. Uh, Being given us wide. Isn't in the big W. Got to catch him. Uh, I told you not to mention brands that aren't sponsoring us. Well, that rules everything out. Do we even sponsor us? I oh. think we do. Brands are us. Surely we've paid for some of these ads. Well, we did them. Oh. Turns out there was one run off that. I'll pull your weight, Lano. Did you get something wrong? Nope. Not me. Not four things. In a row. Seasons. Wooshka. Oh, that's over the top. That could be four. That might go all the way. That is four runs. Much needed four runs. That helps the scoreboard a lot. Just over the fielder in close. And racing away. Great replay, Max. Great Great producing. Likes to be appreciated. Good to be appreciated. I wonder if you can have a second go at that. Well done. I like to be a president. Oh, almost a replay. You're just trying to make up for my short fallings. I had a falling yesterday. Trying to run a quick single with some fool. Four for 30 of 13. You know, I think at this rate, by the uh, 26th over, they might have 60 runs. Well, I think you'd be more definite saying that by the 26th over, they'll have 25 overs under their belt. Assuming they have a belt. You might have a belt a bit later. <laughs> Crosses. Oh, chance there at a catch. That was chipped. And Dale nowhere to be seen. It was chipped like a freshly bought stray from the pound. Wooshka. Oh, it's Ooh. been given as a W. That's a big wub.
Oh, I believe Lano would say the uh, umpires have used up their quota of LBW wickets today. They have. Oh, Ooh. maybe not. No, that's a bit high, that one. That one came through with a bit more pepper on it, so it was actually bouncing upwards. Yeah. I think this is uh, Louise bowling. In the air. Oh, unlucky. As I like to say, sprinting in with the bowlers, people. You'll get them in the starter blocks. No run taken. Oh, we got bat on that. Well fielded. Keeps it to one. All right, Louise Hayko's family, are you uh, watching? Maybe they're the one that keeps on throwing in really short sentences that make absolutely no sense. Blink twice if you're watching over there in England. Oh, overthrows. is silently working on his French inflections beside me. There's the end of the over. Four for 34. 14 bolt. And it looks like there's going to be a change in the bowling. Joy not taking it up. And uh, it's, uh, Kelly back on like she was... The last over, Kelly Scott, thanks for joining us. Thanks, uh, thanks for having me, glad to be here. There we go. Left arm ran, not called to wide. So, uh, Vom Red apparently. Mm-hmm. Did that come in again? Maybe it's Welsh. Well, there's not, no, enough, there's not enough C's. <laughs> Four M's and a silent Q. Sounds like a really strange James Bond movie. Nope. Nope. Joke! It almost sounded like a double hit. Well, it's better than being a uh, one-hit wonder. Hmm. Yeah. That's one taken. Well, thanks for pointing out the obvious there. It's my job. I'm the play by play man. Keeping everyone informed. What's going on? It's left arm round. Oh, that's Ooh. given as well. That's a little bit harsh. I'm not sure exactly what that was given out for. Oh, I'm going to go with LBW. I'm guessing it possibly pitched uh, on about off and she went to play it around the corner with left arm around. Oh, hit on the back leg. You've got to ex assume that the umpire's got the best view in the house. Like that, that back leg was right in front of yeah. middle stump. That'll be drinks now. What a great idea. 5.36. <laughs> All right. Anything else happening anywhere? Here we go. Ah, Negan Garby said Vom Red. Mel Shelley, Calandra, 4 for 41 off 14 up at Coolum. Rosalind Rolls, Louise's mum. It's watching in Budrum, Wooshka. Nice. That's a long way away. So far. It is, but from the furthest viewer we have. If you can beat that, let us know in the chat. Unless you know where Vom Red is. <laughs> so a very important drinks break, being that it's the only one. This is where Karoi needs to put together and formulate their plan for how they're going to bring this home. They do need... 
Where is my scorebook? A lot of runs. 115, I reckon. Of 20 overs. It's all very exciting. There we go. Out to the field to see what's going on out there. Big chats happening. Although we've only got half the chat going on there, so we're not sure what's going on. Anyone do anything exciting yesterday that isn't Mel Shelley? Anyone play cricket? Got some tales to tell? Let us know in the chat. Anyone watching this on the replay, now's your chance to be the only person to have made a comment after the replay of the, uh, the live stream has gone up. You could be the first person to ever leave a comment in about a month and a half, maybe even longer. Luckily, second half of this innings, we're going to get to play one of our favourite games of all time, which is what is Max eating or drinking? I think you're attempting to throw me under the bus, and yet you haven't queued up what the uh, second button here is for cutting. Everything I'm all not, right there? I'm not like you, Maxwell. Well, I thought I'd do a callback to uh, one of our highest oh. viewed streams this uh, season. You're going you're gonna to attempt the Volder Corley tip. I'll see Unsponsored. what I can do. <laughs> if we do. knew, actually, before we were talking about changing fields, and mm. I thought if there's a, a, a club out there that, has, uh, that does fields changing, that would be Maruchador, because every now and then just kind of collapses a bit and you get some rolling hills. Mm. You did miss, uh, there's been a little bit of uh, updates in the chat there that you didn't miss at all because that's what we went through as you were leaving. Someone uh, saying watching for Budrum. Yeah. Well, it's uh, happened again. Watching for Budrum, Budrum. Double Budrum. And Newcastle. Is that Newcastle, uh, Sydney? Or is that Newcastle? Or is this a Newcastle somewhere? Are we I talking? heard some news, but. Uh, Are we talking Newcastle pet? Why I pet that kind of Newcastle? Let us know. And by the way, thanks for uh, pulling the cord out of this, Lano. I did no pulling of cords anywhere. I lightly lifted it and pressed cut. So you cut the cord then? Yep. That's what I did. That could be why it's not working. I don't believe that for a minute. Runner rate required 5.9, so almost six. May as well be six. I think uh, not Budrum, Bundaberg was uh, Louise Pommy, Louise's Pommy mate. I th that seems to me like someone just created that account to comment. Who's this? L Louise Pommy mate. Louise's Pommy mate. Right. Bundaberg. I'm not sure where that is in uh, Pommyland. In the hand of an Australian, probably. We had family bring it. I was going to say, surely there's some uh, sheep herders out there with some Bundaberg, or in Bum Bundaberg. Bundaberg. Dot. And we've got confirmation that it is Newcastle, New South Wales. Interstate viewers, you guys are big time. We are. And handling that kind of pressure shows quite often. It's the end of the over. Well, I did check the numbers and we had a whopping 15 in the... Uh 50, you talk in thousands, don't you? I remember when someone <laughs> asked us that they assumed we were talking thousands. Yes. <laughs> well, 15, that's pretty no, good. It was, 15, was, 15 was 22. Uh, yeah, how many viewers? Oh, you know, 22. 22,000, not bad. No, 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 22. <laughs> oh, let's just let them go with it, shall we? 
Now, uh, the score is 5 for 35, but it says 5 for 36. We're just going to hope that they get a one very soon. Oh, a little bit of a jumpy up. What's that? <laughs> Let's play. What does Max have in his other hand as he dove for that catch? It's a lot of chat out there. Yandina, yeah, very bubbly. They've got some wickets. Oh, that's played around the corner. A lot of spin on that. Look at Kylie. Must watch television right there. Look at that arm. She must have been working on the guns in isolation. Go, Louise, and again. Ooh. Turning the strike over, but I have a feeling they're going to need to increase their run rate just a little bit. Sorry if I'm forcing you to pull out a calculator of some sort there, Leno. We'll get back to your feelings in a minute. There we go. The umpire's just sitting on top of the stumps at the other end there. Louise Hayko, it seems at the moment um, that uh, Louise Hayko's fans are dominating chat. Well, if you're going to watch, uh, this is probably the time to do it. I wouldn't particularly worry too much about the batting innings. it's not on. <laughs> well, you couldn't watch it live tomorrow, could you? Oh, I think we've had a call back in the chat. We've got... Uh, Fat Man. The Fat Man Triple Eight was in the chat last week. Is the Chair of Knowledge unsighted today? Or was uh, that a different ground? Well, it was a different ground, but it appears during the week the Chair of Knowledge, the uh, Weather Chair, got cancelled. I think uh, Twitter got together and cancelled our Weather Chair. We, we are going to try and uh, do what we can. To, to bring you the weather chair in the future. To bring you the weather chair in the future. We've managed to download some some things before it was cancelled from YouTube. The controversial weather chair. Oh, tapped around the corner. Good play. I can see there might be headlines coming up. Telestream. TV's controversial weather chair spotted in Newcastle, New South Wales. Here comes Kelly Scott. Max just with a teaser of what he might be eating. Oh, that's up in the air. That's clear. That's over the top. Look. Hasn't gone all the way. Look at that. Kylie the entertainer. Big chase. She beat everyone to it, showing up everybody. Max with a very apt use of the mute button. Otherwise, people's ear drums would have blown apart, I think. Don't know what you're talking about. It's almost like you're talking and trying to pick stuff out of your teeth at the same time. Don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> There's Kelly Scott. Oh, that's good contact. That's good. That's going to be all the way. That's a six. That is a big one. Six up. Six runs. All right, where's the Karoyam Undi uh, in chat? Let's hear from you. They're making a stand here. 
Stand and deliver. That's been given as wide. Got in, left arm around. Oh, another big swing. Probably could have been a run there. Well, uh, field is we used quite to say deep. When I was playing backyard cricket or cricket against a tree at school, big swing. No ding. I knew that saying was old, Lano, but um, yeah, I won't end that sentence so I don't have to drive any buses. made it sound like you didn't know which button to press. No, it didn't. There's no proof of anything. 5.48 after 17. Got Louise coming into bowl. It's getting a bit leg side-ish. Got to be careful down there. They get hold of that. It's going to go. That's an interesting uh, attempt at running there. They kind of, batsman just kind of jumped a little bit up the pitch. Couple did of times, the, did the herky jerky? Yeah. Yes. No. Wait. Sorry. I'll get you something. Get you a drink. Mm. Got drink. Sounds good. Well, it's within reach. Oh, just trying to tickle it down through the slips area. Been a good over so far. Currently a tie, 11 not out. And Livy Smith, 8 not out. Oh, that's oh, given too. That's given out. Well, the umpires are sharing them around. We got a replay of that one. There's a second camera view on that. Um. Mm, looked a little high, possibly. It was on the up, you might say. Must be a good happy hour where the umpies are going. Hmm. The one and only Kirsty Patton is heading out to bat. She's the one you could hear from behind the stumps during Yandina's innings. Oldest in the team. She's wearing her, her lucky pugilundies. She wanted us to I tell you, you said that. she was swearing. No, she's swearing. Is wearing. Radio. Next batsman. Here we go. So I uh, wonder if if chat's gone crazy. Uh, no, no, it hasn't. Chat has gone absolutely nowhere. Chat's fin it's finishing as many sentences as I am. <laughs> Chat is finito. Fin. That's 18 overs gone. Six for 48. Did you know that cricket is the number one sport currently being watched in this stream? To advertise, contact sponsor at telestream.tv. All right, new bowler. Well, not new bowler, but change in bowling. It's Holston back on again at this end. 
She's got the assistant cap of wonder. Yeah, it's just not going to be the same as a performance enhancing it's headband. It's not a performance enhancing headband. Although if you wore one under an assisted hat of wonder, anything could happen. Bit of movement off the pitch there. So she she balanced leggies. Possibly that one might have even got a bit of movement off the pitch there. That one looked like, well, you're hardly the expert about movement off the pitch and leggies. Don't know what you're talking about. Wushka. It's been hit and a one taken. Kirsty Patton loves a cricket. That didn't, didn't well to get uh, bat on bounce. that. Yeah, didn't bounce very high. Did very well to get bat onto that. From what I hear, she couldn't walk on uh, Monday or Tuesday, and so she's doing, miraculously doing very, well very well out there. I don't know where you get your information from, Max, but that's spot on. That was well played there. We've got a third mic. We could cut both of us out of it. <laughs> All right, here we go. What's going to happen? Just quietly, don't let it hit anywhere on your body that <laughs> isn't the bat. <laughs> I believe that's the fitty up. Six for 50 off 19. Will there be a wicket in the next over? Magic 8 Ball says no. No. Will Max forget his lines? Yes. If you're wondering why there's been more of our own adverts playing of late, it's because Max is using that as cunning cover for shoveling things into his mouth. <laughs> The reason he's not talking currently is because he needs to deal with the shoveled stuff in his mouth. That's being given as a wide. I don't know what you're talking about. It's not very nice of you trying to throw me under bus with such lies. Lies. Ah, uh, this is uh, Lissy Bowling. Yes. I was going to uh, say that, but you were trying game. to drive a bus over me. Not trying. I was driving. Oh. Right around the corner and a one. Do you want to run? I think that was great running by the Cougars. I get nervous with a sentence like that. Oh, I get the feeling this is it. I think everyone can hear everything that's said beforehand anyway. Wooshka! Oh, Wooshka! <laughs> Max is officially switched off for today. Yeah, Max is officially switched <laughs> off for today. <laughs> what would you say if I said you were repeating everything? Oh, well, what would I say if you said I was... <laughs> That's a callback. Oh, I thought she was winding up for another mm. Wollumpka. She looks like she's got uh, some big shots in her and she's just holding it in at the moment, waiting for the right ball. Ah, uh, well, she's a smith. Oh. I don't think that. that was the right ball, but she still wound up for it anyway. Had to, had to go. It's one run. Yeah, good arm. Yes. Store that away. Left arm. What's the matter with you, <laughs> Someone's doing impressions of Simpsons characters with a mute button on. It's another one taken. Great work, girls. 
What a day. What a day to play cricket or watch cricket. Ooh. Here's Alessi Basford in. It's a good shot. Oh, she stopped that with her shin. Mm. Not by the shinny shin shin. And now she rubs it. So no one's looking. What's going on in the chat? Ash B. Can we have a Jerry Springer format for the given out calls with replays as a new segment? <laughs> That's maybe. If we had the replays for all of them. Hey. <laughs> Let's not be like that. Hey. Ow. Get away from me. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes. Uh, update from Mel Shelley up at Coolum. Caloundra, six for 56 off 19. Mm. That's pretty close it's to like, what it's here. It's like... Um, Are you... Re no. Exactly. Tell us what's happening there, uh, Mel. We know what's going on here. It's oh, top edge. Will land safe. A little, little late off the mark. Bit of spin. Good arm, though. Ooh. Was it Sam Cougar? It was a bourbon? I used to drink Cougar. That was a spirit. Max is sitting beside me here. He's getting a bit twitchy because he's seeing these shots and thinking, oh, I'd have a lid on. I'd be right in there. I'd just be lying on my back underneath the I was actually the bat. throwing in some <laughs> replays of what was going on in that last ball where there was almost the run out. Where are you now? I just didn't quite get to it because I'm um, uh, um, yeah, pretty, pretty quick between balls here. Well, I hope nothing. Oh, oh. Come on Probably now. lucky that nobody Come appealed on. for that. Someone did. <laughs> and it wasn't even the wicket keeper, so it must be someone oh, who wants no, to be a wicket keeper. Not a real wicket keeper then. I hope nothing happens on this ball too, because I've had it as the end of the over for two balls now. Good. Oh, still two to come. What the, what <laughs> uh, what happened there? Jeez, Lana, it's like I'm the only person pulling my weight here. Well, it's got to be a tough job for you. You're not pulling very hard. <laughs> <laughs> Hang on. Oh, nice big swing, plenty of ding, but no runs. Max is being sledged from off commentary. and <laughs> <laughs> I'm used to it. <laughs> ah, a non-striker here needs to remember to back up. Oh, Ooh, big contact. shot. Spinning to your right. And they take one. Just as well she was backing up. Good arm in. Don't say it. That's the end of the over. It's been good work. By Karoy. And at the moment we've got the score as 6 for 56. Off 20 overs. Number 4,327. Ah, oh. do some sponsorship at Telestream TV. Sponsor at Telestream.tv. Are good enough? I'm done. Hey. <laughs> oh, you almost all got to tune into some ASMR. Sounded like someone walking with spikes over gravel. <laughs> this is Max with a mouthful of something. Chewing without the mute button on. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> I may have thrown myself under the bus with some of that uh, switching. All right, Alyssa Besford in. Bowling over the wicket. Oh, that's gone through. There's Ky <laughs> Kylie Taylor, the entertainer. Probably lucky they didn't. <laughs> probably lucky they didn't go for two there. There may not have been two in it. <laughs> Luckily, it wasn't, you know, the captain yelling it out or anything. <laughs> Bowling good areas. Well, I tend to think that of people who manage to bowl it and get it on the pitch. I look up to them. 
Oh, I'm amazed. Ooh, that Ooh, could be out. Ooh, there's definitely not a problem with height there. No, umpire's not interested in that one. You kidding me? <laughs> Maybe they've cancelled the happy hour at the bowls club. The umpires aren't going anymore. His shirt's running out of charge. Has he signalled more wides? Oh, I don't think so. Probably signalling wides runs down the charge in an umpire's shirt, I would have thought. Is he coming in? Oh, that's in high. The air, calling it. And Just in front. Ooh, chance at a run out as well. Yes. Good cricket all round. What have we got there? Maxwell. It's gone up, up, up. Um, don't know what's going on there. Well, it's not the first time I've heard that. Here we go. Very close. Is six for fifty eight off twenty two. Turned around the corner, mm, no run taken. That. Probably was a run in that one if they went for it nice and early. Well, maybe they've got a couple of pinch hitters in the bullpen, they're just going to make a game of it like uh, Coolum did. Yeah, <laughs> just coast along as though they're not going to get there and then, and then just send a couple of big hitters out, bring it out. Oh, turned around. Well done. That's a good shot. I don't think it's going to go all the way. Wow. They're going to run the two. That's a good arm from out there. Mm -hmm. I know I'm underarming it from out there with a couple of bounces. Oh, I think it was Underwood out of the boundary. Better not have been. <laughs> I can accept that. Oh, no run on that one. A little closer to the fielder there. Who I think may have been Joy. Oh, gone for a bit of a swing there. Two to come. And the bowler was uh, trying for a cutter. Yes. Peter Voldecauli uh, gives you an update from Coolum. Calandra are eight down now. So it's almost like the runs might be important to add to that as well. They've leapt ahead of Karui Mundi. Well, if, uh, if Kirsty's foot was as badly hurt as it was earlier in the week... You can excuse her for not scampering through for quick singles and the fact that she's the oldest person in the team. And Ooh. keen for a single, but non striker says decided nah, against it. Not so much. That's six for 60 from 23 overs. Did you know that cricket is the number one sport currently being watched in this stream? To advertise, contact sponsor at telestream.tv. All right, Alyssi Bessford ready to continue. As professionalism abounds here in the Bogo Road bunker. Oh. Sounded like she might have got a bit of bat on that. I think she did. Umpire not signalling any buyers or anything like that? No, he's all out of signals. Shirt's very low. He's probably only got maybe a no ball and a woohoo in him. Although lifting one finger is not very heavy. Like Max does to me quite often when I drive a bus over him. That's uh, not the middle finger though. Uh, oh, edged oh, over the top. Edgy bruh. The uh, corridor of calamity. 
Looks like a uh, little edge has come back. As Max brings you some grandpa sounds. Live on a Sunday afternoon. Well, it's not the easiest you know, <laughs> watching the game where we're actually viewing it. One would think if we've got all these screens in front of us, we might actually watch them. Yes, we haven't got used to that yet. Oh, good contact. Plugged away. Place your divot. Run, run. To be fair, if you did a comparison of the run rates, they wouldn't probably be oh, completely out of the question. It's been given as a wide. The uh, charge in that shirt may have gone down a little further now. He might have a solar panel on his hat. See Bestford coming in. That's a good length. And the umpire's not very interested in that at all. Yeah, he's conserving his energy for a while. He's just signalled a wide. He can't go and signal something else again so soon. Not straight after. Yeah, he's lucky that he, he didn't do those two wickets in a row earlier. Yeah. He had a lie down. Good contact, there'll be one in there, eventually. Seems to be a little bit of uh, communication confusion out there. I thought you meant over here. No. It's a well-timed mute button there somewhere. Well done, Barney. Is his last his name last name's not Rubble, is it? That's no. that's a different show. That's yeah, but they wrong. I thought you were gonna say don't. I didn't. Well you shouldn't. Six for sixty-five off twenty-four. Um if I look at the scoring, it looks like five hundred and sixty five, thank you very much. Well, that would make things a bit more interesting. Well, it's going to need to be a bit of a flourish here in the last six overs if they're needing to get the 90 runs. Correct. Thought you were going to call me Captain Obvious or something like that again. No, I thought I'd give you a break for a while, build your confidence up so that we can pack things up quicker. You <laughs> won't be sulking in a corner. <laughs> it's very sunny. Joy's back on. And you're going for the best for team again with the bowling this time. Well, it worked in the batting. Why not try it with the bowling partnership? It's going to be uh, difficult for Joy to end up with six for here. Got a first six with the bat, though. Wonder uh, why they don't have a. Oh! I spoke That's a too good soon. Ball. Middle stump. Come Com back. Commentator's curse there. Let's have a look at that. Well, it's probably a good thing that we got that wicket because it was six for 66. Good ball. Just, uh... Clearing the front leg a little too much there. Yeah. Oh, it's so interesting, uh, I was going to say, <laughs> interesting shot going on there. It's a bit like Bay 13 with Murph Hughes out the front. I really love the way that the whole teams get behind him here. Plenty of support. Someone comes off the field, they all kind of go out and join and support. Yes. Not like us. People are running away going, oh, does that mean I'm going to have to umpire? I'm going to go hide somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> well, they're laughing at the way you got out. It's one, one or the other. other. Well, you're really quick with your... Uh... <laughs> yeah, it's like as soon as there's a wicket, there's a call for umpires. <laughs> I think there's an echo here. <laughs> 
half of this screen has been pro of this stream has been provided by outsourcing and it's uh, a lot of that sourcing might be barbecue <laughs> the side of chicken oh, oh another one yorker and joy's on a hat trick you know what that means though what does that mean a little unfortunate we need to do this oh we get a close that's up right Sorry. On the batsman. Unfortunate, was, but it was, was a very good ball. It was a very good ball there. Let's have a look at it again. Let's look at that. That was a Yorker just perfectly flighted up under the bat. There it is. Let's scroll it back just because the cameraman wants to see again. I thought he was our producer. Checking on us. Middle stump again, that one. Well, as far as I can tell, bowling the ball at the stumps, you're much more likely to get bowled. Joined again by Captain Obvious. Thank you. Well, where was that advice five minutes ago? Yeah, you know, where was that advice five minutes ago? <laughs> Max hasn't said an original thing on the commentary in about ten well. minutes. <laughs> <laughs> it's, uh, he's, che he's, he's clocked off, checked out for the day. And I think yeah. you'll find that Max hasn't said an original thing all day <laughs> in the commentary. Must have clocked off. Yeah. <laughs> right, so that was, that was Rex. Now, who's going to be facing the... The hat-trick ball. The hat-trick ball. You know, it does sometimes feel harsh when we give certain analysis on things. But it's a lot easier to just say it from the sideline than being out there in the middle of it. Absolutely. Although when I'm out there in the middle of it, I normally say the same things as well to myself. <laughs> or other people I'm batting with. Well, had one of the fortunate things yesterday of having one of those umpires who seems to sledge you when, when you're batting as well. Yes. Now, who have we got facing the Patrick Ball? I think it I, might be I don't know. Uh, it would be very nice to know who's uh, facing the hat-trick ball. Uh, Rachel, Martin. Rachel Martin's been sent out. The Sheriff of Hat-trick. Oh, oh, it's a hat-trick! got it! It's a hat-trick! Yes. That's a great, great delivery again. Throwing the Yorker in. Dare we ask... Okay. Okay. Well, if we can get the close-up on the batsman there. Because it needs to happen again. Unfortunate. I wouldn't want to be going out to uh, face Joy while she's bowling like this. Well, it wouldn't be a Joy. And the exact same thing again. It's no, that's, that's not the same replay, but it is the same it result there. Be. Middle stump going over, and that's a hat trick for Joy Besford. What a day she's having. 50 with the bat, first six now, of all time, retired, I and who knows how many wickets and now. And a I'm wondering if that is Joy's first hat trick ever as well. So it's a day of first, first six, first 50, first hat trick. Is that a Pfeiffer? And her first Pfeiffer. Look, you're ruining my story. She's basically going to be the sponsor of next week's kitchen sink, I think. Uh, and I need to apologize with the, with the pictures. Max There's something has gone very wrong here. Max has gone a little bit something, something. We will get pictures back up for you as soon as we can. We've turned it off at the wall and we're turning it on again. That's a, a full ball played back down to uh, short mid... Well, actually, short covers. Okay, sorry about that. Slight issue with the computer system that 
controls the switches. Oh, it's another one. Oh, no. That's bold. Well, I don't know how much of that I got, but we'll see. Well, at least we got some of it. We got some of that one. That is game here at Yandina. Uh, Yandina have come home like a rocket, taking the last four wickets. Last four wickets in one over. Yeah, that was me. I called that she may end up with a six for. Max is trying to claim everything around here now. Well, I got it on the replay. I'll show you when I... Because <laughs> I've been pulling my weight. I think that echo has come back again. Your weight, you say? Pulling something. <laughs> well, that... Joe! <laughs> that is victory to Yandina. A dominant display in the final. I was denied a hat trick in my junior years <laughs> by Chuck Perkins umpiring. <laughs> if you're out there, Chuck, I don't hold it against you. <sighs> Collie Hawkins telling us he's had three hat tricks. Well, some of us haven't even got three wickets, so thanks so much for the uh, insult. <laughs> Ah, there we go. We're back. Now let's try that replay again. Where is that replay? I don't know how much we got. Something we'll find out. Replay. Yeah, look at that. Oh, no. It might have only just been the end. No, didn't catch it. No, it's... Isn't it uh That was the one before. No. Yeah, same bats person must have gone out again. I might not have got anything then. Nothing. Nothing doing. Wow, well, what a finish it has been here. So All Joy out for 66. Joy Bestford, I mean... Four overs. Three for six. Two maidens, two whites. So four off the bat. What an effort. Let's, uh, let's throw it back out to the field there because that's a hell of an effort from Yandina. And especially Joy Bestford. Well, we hope to find out what happened up at Coolum. But um, whoever wins up there, I don't know that you want to be facing a Yandina team that's uh, just come off a, a win like this. They'd be very confident. And Mr. Voldercawley has said all finished at Coolum. Coolum are through to the big dance. Here come the Sharkettes. So, so we could have a repeat of last week. It's going to be another week. repeat. Of <laughs> all of Coulomb. the games that we have, Yandina Coolum have been very, very close. And um, I did hear Yandina saying this morning, they hope that um, Caloundra gets up because they don't want another close <laughs> one. <laughs> well, who could argue with that? Well, it's been a fantastic day of cricket. Um, it has. Really, really good stuff going on out in the, in the field. Cricket was the winner. Both teams Absolutely. played fantastically. Karoy bowled very, very well. And it was only a few late runs that uh, got Yandina the total, which put the pressure on uh, the scoreboard. Well, we may look at signing off, and we will see you next week. Next week for the final. The big, the big match. We don't know where it's going to be, other than on YouTube. So you can watch it right here on YouTube. And as always, if, uh, if you want to know when stuff's coming on, notifications, make sure you... Subscribe, hit the bell, and if you didn't enjoy this stream, hit that like button. Let's us know. If you did enjoy the stream, hit that like button. If you couldn't care less and you came here by mistake looking for Virat Kohli batting classes, hit the like button. All right. It's been a fantastic day. We look forward to seeing you next time. On behalf of Telestream TV, this is us, Gonski.